that's... Okay, wait. There we go. Oh, I get this. My stream. <laughs> Sorry, stream. I was trying to get things together. It's like, um... Which one is it? And also, today we have a person here with me. Yes, it's not me alone. Oh my gosh, I'm here. Yes, x -bar, you're here. We're here together. I'm so here. Like some little goody two-shoes. Um, where did I leave off is the, like, the real question. Let's turn my headphones down a little bit too, because it's... Love the music, but it's a bit loud. Um, what was I doing? Items? No, it's not items. It is map. Uh, I'm doing chores. Yes, there you go. Okay, so I need to go around helping and getting some stuff. I wanted to go chop wood so I can become better at it because I want to get s because I'm really good at chopping wood. Uh, actually, before that, I probably want to talk to everyone because there's new dialogue here. Uh, I still don't know how to say this girl's name. Ah, uh, there you are, Elise. Oh, old Josh and Truly went too far. Oh yeah, um, last episode, um, the last stream, uh, old Josh and called Elise a witch. So he's basically accusing her. And I find that quite rude. Can't be calling people witches. Uh, you can't it, be calling people witches. Yeah, it is. It is technically rude. Especially when you live in like a town like. Uh, like this, where everyone's like, burn the witch, burn them. Yeah. I, s <laughs> I suppose. I There's no need to uh, hold your tongue, lass. That was far from reasonable. Nobody agrees with him. I suppose there comes a time when old folks lose their minds. You're right. He was wow. lost his mind. He's old. Wow. He's crazy. I don't know. I mean, she's also old too, so she's like, she understands. <laughs> she's losing it a bit too. Now that's a different story, Mariel. I wouldn't say... There's no story, Ludwig. Elise was singing and dancing, so what? Oh yeah, she had like a little... She saw she got... Elise got new shoes. And she like... Was singing and dancing throughout the entire town. About her new shoes, how she was like... Is basically kind of wealthy. So basically, she was talking to um, Singy about vanity and oh. her lust for wealth, basically. Oh. So they were like, hmm. no, bad. Truly. I'm not gonna say fair. It's, it's not unfair. <laughs> Old Joshin's outburst was rather distasteful. But I have been meaning to ask, where you got those shoes, Elise? Oh, they're. You don't have to tell us, Elise. You're right about what you said. We all should be tra treating you with a little more respect. Oh, but I am awfully curious. So they're curious about my new kicks. They're pretty good. Hello, little children and madam. Look, mama, they're so shiny. Like, I've ever seen, let's see, um, of course, you must have already, like, seen, um, Dorothy from... What, what is it? What is it called? The Wizard of Oz. There we go. She kind of. Finding Nemo. Oh, what? Dory. I said Dorothy. Fish. Dorothy. Oh, Dorothy. Dorothy. Oh. <laughs> you said Dory. I thought you said Dory, and I was like, no. yeah, no, the fish. <laughs> no, 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 no. Dorothy from Wizard of Oz. So she got like the new red shoes from the witch mm -hmm. that the uh, the house fell on top of. Yeah. That's what it reminds me of her shoes. They're so the shiny. On top of the person that has um, we don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I got some new shoes. Got some new kicks, and I'm rocking oh, them. Oh. You stole those, Elise. Be honest. Oh wow! Now he's calling me a thief. I didn't steal uh. them. You settle down now. You two. More importantly, are you all right, my dear? Uh, about earlier, I. There's no need to hold your tongue, Elise. The town folks made too much of it. That wasn't remotely acceptable. Everyone knows old Josh has lost his wits. Don't you start, uh, Alpha? 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 I don't know how to say this guy's name either. Do you want? Do you know how to say Apfel. his name? I don't know. Apfel. Apfel. Then I see what's called. I say Apfel then. Oh, Mama, can I get shoes like that too? You have. Ugly ogre feet. Oh, mm. 
Tim. <laughs> oh my god. Mama Elf is being mean again. You call your sister's feet ogre feet. Can't you two see I'm trying to talk to Elise? I'm alright, Miss Elizabeth. Thank you. We can catch up later, Elise. I best I best go. I to have a word with Ugwin. My goats aren't doing so well. Oh, Griffy! Oh, Griffy! Oh my god. <laughs> this boy is so mean. Hello, wait, who are you? They... They... Seems to be from the I guess. <laughs> who, is, who is this? I've never seen this lady before, I think. Machatel? Yes. Matelda? I think Matelda. Matelda, I think. Question mark. Oh, Elise, you scared me uh, stiff earlier. Oh, wait, I... Wait, was that? I think I saw her at night time. I remember seeing her at night time. Question mark. I don't know. I did? It takes me a great deal of courage to put those two in their place. You did well, Elise. They're the ones being unreasonable. So it seems like most of the townspeople are kind of uh, siding with Elise. That um, old Joshin was being quite crazy with his uh, accusation. Okay, Cass Cassie. Yes. Be honest with me. Do you think that the, the accusation was unnecessary? Cause I, I wasn't here for that. Part. Oh, for Elise? Yeah, yeah. Just be honest. Out of like, re not regarding you know this person at all. Do you agree with her, or do you think the guy was right? No. Oh. Well, okay. the thing is, like, this is supposed to be like a small community of people so it's like it's not like this is a town where random people just are here this is like a community of people that are known each other for a long time grown up with each other because really Elise has grown up in like I will say in the mountains but she's basically grown up only knowing that this is her home even though she wants to leave so it's like everyone knows her she knows everyone else so to be like hey you might be context you're my family <laughs> But you're a witch. Burn her. That's basically what he just did. <laughs> okay, yeah, that's right. That's right. Yeah, it's, it's a, a small yeah, town. Just want to get your honest opinion. That's, right. that's just my uh, perspective of it, if I'm being quite honest, in terms of stuff. Because it's a small community, and everyone knows each other, basically. I think I'm basically talking to every like person inside this entire town, basically. Or if not almost. Miss Telda. They'll be blabbing on and on about it in church, I wager. Would you say they'll be wanting a word with me, Miss Matilda? They might, but you have nothing to fret about, Elise. I can assure you, no one soul, no one, not one soul in Kieferberg thinks ill of you, my dear. See, like everyone loves each other. Kind of. <laughs> Thank you, Miss Matilda. <laughs> That is definitely a word after mm. when you just told me. <laughs> Besides, the town folks are uh, still shaken by the windstorm. I wasn't sure if we got to that far. They said there's a windstorm. Yeah, we got that far. There's a windstorm. Yeah. Yeah. They thought it was the witch. I'd say I'll... i say they'll forget all about you and your shoes by the afternoon. Well, I wouldn't be so certain. That was in internal dialogue right there. Yeah. Now, there's nothing over here. I want to, like, I think I kind of said this before, but I want to make sure I'm getting everyone's perspectives and things in this. As in, like, talking to all of them. Oh, wait, can we go down this way? You know, if this oh was a God. Minecraft town, I'd be very impressed if somebody made something like this. So I want to talk to everybody and stuff. Oh, okay, so the city has, um, the town has opened up because there was the windstorm, so there was branches and stuff all around the place. So we couldn't actually, um, get everything. Uh, with that, I could talk to Audily. Oh yeah, she's a little, she's a little, mm, a little crazy. That is, that is a wild thing. She's a little, mm. I look at her, she's holding her hands like that. Like she's, she clearly has some kind of mental illness and I'm like, sweetie, like, come on, sit down. Let's come sit down. Sit down, talk right. with me, sit talk with me. I'll be a therapist. <laughs> oh, how dreadful. Look what the windstorm did to our poor alleyways. Yes, it really did. So much <laughs> it did away with a few things I see. You make too little of it, Elise. No, 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 no. It's a windstorm. That's it. 
I don't think what I don't know what else there is to say about the windstorm, Miss Otterly. Most of the town folks have already put up put it behind them, so why can't you? Oh Joshin's just as concerned as as I am. Uh-huh. Accusing me as a witch, yeah sure. Last, and for good reason. Oh, here we go again with old Josh and... <laughs> uh, that reminds me. Yes. I can assume you... I can assure you, Miss Otterly, those shoes aren't... Old Wilhelm? Wilhelm's? Making a rosary for my, um, precious granddaughter, Grizzle? Gizzle? Gizzle? Grizzle? Gizella. Gizella. <laughs> Gizella. Cinderella? The off friend girl? The off one friend boy? Oh, no. The off friend Cinderella. <laughs> oh, no. You see? Won't you please go see if it's ready for me, Elise? I suppose. Wait. Who am I getting? Who am I? Who's this for? <laughs> I just blanked. You forget? Um, investigate the note. No? Um, yeah, Lily just forgot. Wait. I'm pretty sure it's for her daughter. It was like her present, right? No, like, who am I supposed to go to? Her like, daughter, I thought. No, I have, to go, I have to go get the thing for her daughter. Where? That's the windmill. Though did she know that her daughter was hit by the windstorm? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> okay, um, who do I have to go to to get the... Mm. Person, I've already forgotten. Sorry, lady, you're not getting that stuff. Oh, doggy. Hello, dog. Uh, I'm exploring. Okay, I'm back. Um, who do I need to... Who do I need to talk to? Can I? Can I see, like, past text? Can Wait, you try talking to her again? Let me talk to you, and then if I go to the log... I think I see... Okay, um... Oh, well, oh, Will, oh, cause Wilhelm's making okay, I don't so where is Ooh. Willaham? <laughs> Willaham? Wilhelm's? I don't know his name. No. <laughs> With old Will Wilhelm? It's just a Wilhelm? Oh Wil wait, no, it is that way. I thought I thought I thought you were talking about a different person. I was like, you just read up No, no, that is Wilhelm. Okay. Uh, I say Willaham. Sorry, I was, I, was just... the, I was on the phone for like three <laughs> seconds and I was like, Kesson, how did you already forget the name? And I looked back and I was like, oh, no, that, that is not, that is not the name that I saw. <laughs> this is another, this is another. Are you talking about the old lady? Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> I need to go find Willaham. Will, Willaham, okay, I need to stop saying it like that. Where's this old man? Oh, yeah, there is like a celebration going on that's going to be happening. So, the town people are getting ready for it. No, okay, I'll find them first and talk to all these people. Because I think I'm going to be here all day. Ah, if it... If it's not the last of the moment. Oh, here's here's the... Um, the, what, the Mean Girls squad right here. The, the Mean Girls? The, oh my gosh, it's a yeah, the gossipers of the town, I promise you. I actually don't even know what a mean girl is really, but yeah. The movie? Uh, mean Girls? Girl. <laughs> I'm, I'm, the... I'm gonna be honest with you, I've never seen it. <gasps> oh no. You've never seen the movie Mean Girls? I know, I know, I'm a bit behind. Alright. Everyone's seen it. No, I don't think everyone's seen it, but nah, it's that pretty... Was a lie. That was a lie. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty popular though. I, I know it is, because I've heard it like everywhere. <laughs> yeah. I've heard it referenced multiple so times. So basically it's kind of like three schoolgirls basically being the queens of the school and they're just being like you're popular you're not oh. you're ugly get out oh. yeah like oh, that uh tell us all about those shoes why don't you what about them miss Wil 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 wilma there we go wilma. what about them she says oh out with it last we're losing our minds here Oh, no. You two faced. You oh, guys should go see a therapist if you're losing your minds. I would love to say you two faced hags, but uh, last time I said something bad to these people, they were like, "You're a witch." So <laughs> <laughs> it's, that it's is the accurate response. You say something bad about somebody. <laughs> I guess. Mm, yes. Um, the Granny Hollies. I found them under Granny Holly's bed this morning. 
It seems they were a gift she intended to give me, but... I can't say I'm too convinced, Elise. What? There's no way old Holly could have uh, afforded those. You, on the other hand, I wasn't aware you had the means, Elise. And I don't, as you know. Girl, I barely have enough food to like last me the day. I've had to work with chickens, cutting wood, just to afford a few pieces of bread. It's crazy out here. Pretzels are skyrocketing. The economy is just not booming. It's going down. <laughs> this bread is expensive. Oh, <laughs> bread is expensive, man. I gotta work every day just to get a piece. I gotta go and break my ankle every day. Just to get a piece of <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> oh, why, but. Why, but neither did Holly. So, you mean to say you found them under her bed? That is what I said, Miss Emma. Emma? Elma. There you go, Elma. Old Emma. Holly was full of surprises, that's true. How could we forget about those, about the day she brought Elise to Kieferberg? Lord knows what else that old lass was hiding, huh? Yeah, look, suspicion went down. They're about it's to. It's not like they're gonna break in. Yeah. About to break me. Can I talk to that you? Is, that is a wild thing to say. That is a wild thing. Look at the look at the water. They want to tear you limb from limb over here. These three, oh, these three are dangerous. I promise you. <laughs> they're Yo, very dangerous the people. Got power. Like I should probably talk to my um, love interest. Oh, I did not. Maybe I just forgot the last fight. This this is the next day, so I've already met with. I'm so um, proud of you, Kessie. Yeah, she's just a little something. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. That, that's not the way how people typically talk about their love. Who said anything about love? The love interest. You gotta prove to oh, me yeah. first that she wants all this at least. Wait, just just one, one more question before we go. Isn't it your love interest? It's at least his love interest. <laughs> Oh. So, ah. so you're not. Oh, okay. I thought you were, I thought you were talking about you as like in the character and everything. Like, uh, yes, yes, I'm Elise. You see, uh, mode, and I was like, and I, I was like, oh, so so the character loves them, and then you're like, no, and then you're like, yes. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay I'm breaking the fourth wall right here. <laughs> okay, no, sorry, sorry, sorry. Uh, my Elise, look <laughs> at those shoes. Red truly does look best on you, Elise. I'm sorry, I've not been seeing her entire outfit. It's all red. From top to bottom, it's all red. <laughs> no, no, only that bit. Only that bit. It's all red. They're colorblind everywhere else. It's just there. Oh, oh she's colorblind as heck. Oh, I think I can see a little baby bump. She, this woman right here is pregnant. I see the little baby bump. See? Oh, no. What do you mean, oh, no? Oh, okay. Yeah, no. That, sorry, Discord sometimes takes a little while. So when you're circling over Elise and saying that like her entire outfit is red, uh, your mouse kind of stayed there. <laughs> and I was, when you said that, and I'm like, oh, this is, this is, no, this she's not pregnant. No, no, continue. Just kidding. Just kidding. Oh <laughs> god. Mm. Well, she's pregnant, so yeah. This course off the I just wanted to put out the detail that I didn't know she had like a little baby bump right there. Uh, why? Thank you. Because I am the best. <laughs> Oh, you, you, oh, oh, you have to wear them at the, to the festival, at least. Yes, yes, yes. Of course. I don't think she's ever going to take them off, really. Uh, now it is the time to find yourself a proper suitor, at least. That's precisely what we're chatting about with Freya. Oh, yes. Are you, aren't I a little too young to be looking for a husband? Why, the sooner the better, I say. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's not exactly what I like to be doing with my time, if I'm honest. <laughs> this husband better be able to like uh, put the whole family on his shoulders at this point, because she gotta work her back on a piece of bread. Uh, what a baby gonna do? Now it's two pieces of bread. Exactly. Now it's two pieces. Including the husband. Oh no, yeah. he's mm, barely get get by at that point. <laughs> barely get by. And then maybe, just maybe, once upon a time, they're able to get a pretzel. <laughs> just a legendary pretzel right there. 
Just a little pretzel. <laughs> when I get the whole thing, just half of it. <laughs> Literally. I'm used- <laughs> I used to feel the same way until I met Ben. You'll see. Oh, that's her boyfriend, I think. I'd say Freya's got a good chance of meeting her future husband soon. Oh, Miss Brunhild. I wouldn't say I'm... You're quite the catch. I'm not sure if it's Brunhilda or Brunhild. So I switched between them. Uh, Isn't she bored? I think it's just Brunhild because there's no duh. Yeah. Brunhilda. I don't know. I make up I make up names. I promise you. It's okay. I make up with I'd be like, oh, word. That's the word. No, that's one of the <laughs> new, that's the new meaning to me. Nah, that's okay. Uh, isn't she Dorothea? Oh, Freya is the catch. Uh, the catch. Uh, in truth, I I do feel the same as Elise. My interests lie elsewhere. You see. Oh, you don't mean sewing. And I have my hus my hands full with the festival too. This really isn't the time. Oh, that reminds me. Would you come and meet me by the well today at dusk, Elise? Sure. Oh, uh, yes, I suppose. But the thing is, I'm. Am I meeting. Um, what's her name? I've already forgotten. What's her name? <laughs> the other one. Not Leb. Well, maybe. I'll remember one day. Don't worry. Ooh, I'm gonna grab a cup of water. Okay, okay. Uh, you two will come around, I'm certain. Okay, so I gotta meet Freya. So, who was I thinking of? So I don't think I have to meet... What is her name? She's really at my house. She stays there. <laughs> Wait, so I went down this way. So that's me going this way. So I need to go find Wilhelm. Because he... I need stuff from him. It might be that I have to go, like, get it, find it the next hour or so, or the, like, the next um, time. So what's down here? Oh, it, it's a well. Oh, this place is so pretty. I mean, a little beaten up. But, it's so cute. How many afternoons did I spend here wasting, uh, washing these folks' clothes, I, want, I wonder? Kieferberg's washing well. A statue of a fish standing in the center. Oh, there's the well. I need to find where these people are. I'm assuming that I most likely just... Wait, what place have I not been? Okay, I, 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 I pressed M for map. I should be doing that a lot more, so... I've... <laughs> I haven't been at the stables or the windmills. That's where I need to go. Nothing that I'll go see, um... Oh! Hello! You spend plenty of time for, um... Repairing the stable's roof. That's for certain. Hard at work, are you at least? Sure am. The economy. As always, Mr. Henrich. You've heard about... Ugwins? 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 Of course, then. Folks are more interested in what happened this morning, Henrich. What about your horse, Miss, Mr. Enrich? 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 Who knows? I'll call him Jin. His name is Jin now. Unless you, because I don't think I'm ever gonna say it right. I'm getting a couple new ones. Wait, is this? Ugwen, Ugin, Eugene. Oh no! Oh no! It's not that far. I've been saying. I've been. I don't know what. Like I've been putting some kind of accent on this kind of twist. I don't know what I've been. I mean, at first I didn't. I didn't know what this word was like at all. But then I started hearing it being called like people more and more often than they call it Carbs Eugene. I think it's just like man or something because they call it Crab Sack. They call it Squidward. Uh, it's, it's weird. Now let's go with Eugene. His name is Eugene now. Is the E? Yeah. I would never think Eugene because maybe the E silent is what I'm thinking. 
Because there's a lot of words where it'd be like, there'd be like a whole letter in front of it, and be like, no, that's silent. I'm like, what? What's, why is it there then? Uh, but yes, yeah, so his name is Eugene now. Mr. Krabs. I'm getting a couple new ones. <laughs> is all nothing of great importance. I want to put it like that, lad. Horsepower is essential to your business, isn't it? Merchants can't lift a finger without their horses. That's great news, Mr. E Eugene. For Kieferberg too, I'll be lending a hand with the preparations. Full of promise, aren't we? Okay, so I was just like a little talk about horses then. Ooh. Horse, horse, horse. Horse, 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 horse. Granny Holly used to have plenty of cabbage in our backyard. Several cabbages have flourished on the field, nearly ripe enough to pick. Oh, now it's wheat. How do they get their wheat to grow this tall, I wonder? Fully packed and golden, the wheat head sway gently in the spring breeze. Why am I reading all these? I don't know. I thought about a scarecrow. Fun. It's just, it's just a read. I wonder if this does anything to scare the birds off. And the old shirt and a straw hat rest mounted on a flimsy wooden statue. I love the music once again. Oh, this is a tree? What's this? I stacked them so neatly for Mr. Eugene and look at them now. In the corner, various bundles of hay have been racked, rakes together in a disorganized pile. Oh. Okay. I think that's really everything over here. Oh, mushroom patch. What's over here? What's over? Oh! Wait. Oh, we got all the Oh, okay. So everyone everyone leads here. Okay. I'm learning. Learning the layout. That's so good. I'm so proud of you. What is this? Someone wrote one, the nine in chat. Is that an I? I'm assuming. Uh, there's some beats? What are these? Some of these aren't looking so good. Yeah, they're that's right. There's a whole array of colors. There's a problem here. <laughs> they're all different colors. Several row of beets. Some of them are looking rather withered and dry. The whole <laughs> color wheel right now. Beautiful. Hello, who are you? Sir? Let me talk to you. Oh my god. <laughs> you scared me. Oh, it's Wilhelm! Oh my god! Thank god! Say, uh, Mr. Wilhelm, Miss, Mrs. Audley asked me to see about her rosary. Ah, uh, that old hag, hmm. Can't <laughs> give me a moment of peace. These people, these old people are constantly insulting each other. Oh, I suppose. <laughs> Tell her she can come by my workshop this afternoon, will, will you? I'll rustle her up a rosary in no time at all. So everyone start making on there or... <laughs> okay. I thought you were making her a new one. In a way, lass. Haven't you heard of... Reposing? Repurposing? Oh, mm. <laughs> I'll be the best rosary... <laughs> Roserer, rosary? It'll be the best rosary she ever seen? Huh? Maybe then she'll stop nagging me. Oh no. Okay, I'm gonna skip you a thousand dollars to make me this new diamond encrusted ring. Okay. Oh, what's this on the floor? Here you go. <laughs> Here's your new ring. <laughs> Literally, that's what he's doing. I'm not lying. Ooh, think. Okay, I'm not gonna say that he isn't scamming her, but also that he is a very smart guy. <laughs> I got a toy horse. Huh. I don't know why. I don't know what it's doing for me. Oh, I can think here. If it wasn't for Granny Gretel, I'd say I'd have to make my own bread every day, every other day. A workbench sits outside, 
typically used by the townsfolk of Kukaberry to uh, bag a newly milled flower. Oh. It's the same thing? Oh yeah, it's the same thing. Can I go inside? Is there anything over here, just in case? Nope, nothing. Okay. Let's go inside. It's locked, I suppose. It's not like I make my own bread. I don't need to get in there. Ow. Oh. But I want to go in. Well, I want to go in. We can't, we can't always have a Why not? I want to go in. Well, you can't have a bread, can you? You're right, I'm poor. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I'm dirt poor the economy. <laughs> Um, it's corn. I don't know why, but I love this smell. Several stalks of corn stand tall, their leaves a vibrant dark green. I love the smell of corn. It really gets me going. Yeah, good stuff. <laughs> Don't you love corn, next bar? Um... Sure. I gotta love the corn! Hey. It's all in the corn. Okay, I want to go chop wood because I'm not doing it with these chickens. What, what do you want me to do? It better not be chickens. Mama won't let me chop wood for her. Okay, it's chopping wood good. Don't be silly, Jacob. You're much too young to handle a hatchet. Can you get me some wood for the hearth? Hearth? There we go. Elise? Of course. Now I've got to remember how um to chop. <laughs> chop, chop. Your mother's right, Jacob. You're too little. I am not. You're a stubborn lad. That's what you are. <laughs> okay, this time okay, I'm gonna be good. I'm gonna be amazing at this. And I just need to remember how this works again. I think it's just Q and G. Q and E. Okay. Wait, you said you were very good at this. I mean, it's been some time since I've done this. Remember. Like three days, four days? I don't remember. Three days? Yeah, so it's E R. Okay. 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 I'm gonna be. I gotta be quiet because I gotta focus. Oh my god. Okay, okay, okay. No! Shut up. Okay, I've got to do this again because I'm getting effed up. Fudge. I gotta do this again. I have to do this again. It's I'm. Mm. I did so much so, better before. How about you focusing 100%? <laughs> I got A before, so I was just I was doing bad this time. I don't have enough to redo it. Oh, oh, <laughs> oh, no, please. No. Oh, he is. <laughs> no, you've d he says you've done enough. <laughs> no. I need this. This is my only thing. See, Mama? I could chop that much of wood. Shut up, you little... Mm. <laughs> true. You can have this, at least. Thank you. Watch your mouth, little boy. I chop wood like it's a pro. Smart. You can smart. Be quiet. <laughs> chop you up, too. He's finding, he's finding jobs so he can handle. <laughs> mm. Ah, thank you, Miss Linda. Can I give it a try tomorrow, Mama? One more word about this and I'll tell your father you lost his pocket knife. Eek! Okay. It is the afternoon. 
Okay, I need to go get bread because I am starving. Uh huh. Oh no, it's this one. I thought I'd never find you, Elise. Hi. Oh, what now, Miffy? Oh, her name's changing every time. There we go. It's your. I don't have food for you, Shoo Shoo. But, Elise, it's your. My what? Your friend. Oh, the person locked in the basement. Uh, no, oh, we don't have a basement. There's an attic. And she can get out, she can get out anytime. <laughs> Rosemarine, there we go. Her name is Rosemarine. That's how I was talking about. Uh, the, la the last with that funny hat, she's right outside. I need her not to do this right now. There's like a whole witch epidemic going on and she's coming out here looking <laughs> like a witch. Oh no. But I have me brought down with her. Yeah, that's how I'm looking right now. That's my face. <laughs> Dripping in sweat. Take me to her, Molly. Right now. Her name changed again. Let's not just not forget about that. I told I told everyone about my theory about Muffy. What's your theory? That she's secretly mind controlling everyone to fit so she fit into the town. And now everyone's like has some kind of side effect that I can't say her name correctly. She's the true witch of it all. So, so this is... This is Don't worry about it. My, you're covered in dirt, lass. Oh, oh I'm... She's so funny looking. Look at that silly hat. Ang Angela? Angelak? I don't know how to say her name. Jesus. Don't be rude. Do you know this last Elizabeth? Elise, she's from Primadorf. Primadorf. Primadorf? Primadorf? Don't. Yeah. Primadorf. Primadorf. Let's just say Primadorf. Primadorf. <laughs> the L there, so I'm kind of like... I don't know. Oh, I'm not from Primadorf. I've never had a... What? I haven't... I haven't the faintest idea. Uh, I'm looking for Elise. Have you seen her? Elise, do you know her? We do happen to know Elise, but how do you know her, lass? Oh, the hostility is coming through. Ah, uh, Elise says she's... She's adopted. Um, oh, no. That is, that, is, that is the wrong thing to say. Hmm. When did you hear about this, Melly? Her name's changing. Keeps on changing. Like the seasons. <laughs> oh, if you don't... Oh, uh, if you... Please tell me where... Look, Mama, she's... Has a tiny scarecrow. Where? Oh, no. She's looking more and more like a witch right now. Forgive me, but... Does anyone know where I can find Elise? And that is the problem. I'm causing all these problems. Rosa Marie. Uh uh uh. Rosa Marie. <laughs> Crazy. Her what are you doing here, you? So you do know the last Elise? Ah <laughs> uh, yeah, she's um. Uh. Together, Elise. Think, Elise. Think. A distant cousin from Primdorf. Why? Why? You don't have cousins, at least. I like how it was like, you have cousins when we were like really found in the woods. Like the whole start of it, we were in the woods. Did its magical cousin also be like right next to us as we were like just found there? Yep. I do recall old Holly's mother had a sister, but I've never met her. <gasps> oh my god, thank you, Matilda. Keep weaving the lie for us. Weave it for us until it becomes true. <laughs> yes, exactly. Rosemary here is my aunt's granddaughter. Ah, uh, yes, it's Rosemary. Oh, I'm so very pleased to meet you, Rosemary. Oh, thank you. Anyhow, it's getting quite late. We best move along before. Uh, but do tell me, dear. How long have you known you had a cousin? 
Okay, I needed a, you, you helped us in the beginning, but I need you to step back now. You're getting a little, a little too close to the truth. You helped us before, so back away, old lady. <laughs> uh, Granny Holly told me about her. Met her this Saturday. Crazy. I'm gonna say Granny Holly. <laughs> yes, I'm gonna say Granny Holly. She said Rosemary here might show up one day, you see. I never got to meet my aunt before she passed, but I'm glad I got to meet my cousin. Ah, oh, I see, I see. Hmm, she believes that as quick as she makes the lies for us at this point. Uh, and she turned up just in time for the festival, too. Okay, I get at least gets accused for being a witch, but she just gets um, she comes here with open arms. Okay, mama, mama, can't the funny lady come play with us? These children are make insults where they're not even trying to make insults. They're so cute, but oh my god, backhanded compliments just smack me in the face. Uh, I wouldn't mind. I wouldn't want to bother you, Rosemary. Mm -hmm. <laughs> You're all very welcoming, but we ought to move along and... Oh, wonders, Elise. How did you meet your cousin then? <laughs> okay, still asking these questions. Just believe and forget. <laughs> <laughs> she sent someone to keep her bird. I found her along outside the crossword roads. I think she sent someone to keep her rigs. <laughs> and then he found her on the roads. Road. Yes, that's. <laughs> oh, I met my cousin today. She was um, she was on the roadside. <laughs> I decided to pick her up. <laughs> I was like, oh. yeah, found her on the roadside. And we got to talking, and she was like, yeah, I'm your cousin. I was like, that's crazy. Come, come on, come to my house. Got some good food there. <laughs> Some good bread, but don't eat all. I only have so much economy, remember? <laughs> <laughs> she sent someone to keep her bird. <laughs> Rosemary asked someone from Primdorf Prim to ask around keep her bird, you see. Okay. Ah, I see. I can't say I remember anything of that sort. Of the sort. <laughs> uh, people wanting to know information. You know, like, uh, if you could. Uh, you look kind of old. Why don't you the amnesia kicking in? <laughs> Old timers, don't worry about it. St sit down. Wow. Take yourself a seat. I'll help you remember with this shoe. Oh man, that, that's all it takes. I'm surprised such a thing didn't make itself known about uh, about town. Not that you mentioned. Uh, you see, we. Oh, phrase for being rude. Arena, Ar Ar Aran, Aran. Wait, why do you saying this woman's name? I've been trying to say it for the longest. I just haven't been saying it because I don't know how to say it. Arena. I think maybe Arena. Yeah. I'm gonna say Arena. I must say, I'm curious too. Didn't we just talk to you? Like, calm down. Like, you already know. You basically leaving the lie for us. Just believe your own lies, please. <laughs> well, I'd love to sit and chat, but we don't have time. Ah, of course, we, uh, we want to sweep the living room. You are a terrible liar, Rosemary. <laughs> it's truly a pleasure to meet you all. <laughs> Let's go, Rosemary. Let's go. Oh no, our suspicion went up. <laughs> oh no. I your suspicion? But, suspicion you know, went up. that seemed less sus than let's call than them calling out for being a glitch. I'll be honest. I don't know how that went up. Yeah, uh, you know, things happen. Uh, this, uh, um, you, you, why are you here? Got people thinking I'm a witch. For goodness sake! Have you completely lost your wits, Rosemary? <sighs> I'm sorry, Elise. You should be. I know you had a bird's nest for a brain, <laughs> Jesus, but this is too much. Well, she got the straw <laughs> hat on her head for her, you know, the nest. No, no. <laughs> no. Uh, well, you know what you did. I'm sorry, Elise. I didn't mean to. I was chasing after Flock, you see. For goodness sake. 
bro is marine. Why not let him frolic about? That's what goats do. He took the laundry I was tending to right out of my hands. Oh no. Oh. I couldn't let him ruin your sheets. Oh, so you're. Oh, my bad sheets. Oh, yeah, you should have chased that. Sh chased him down. I'll say get a bow and arrow. <laughs> Those are my sheets. <laughs> uh -oh. Alright, well. Truth is, we made a complete mess of it. Got that right. I don't even want to think about what Father Han's reaction. Uh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to trouble you. Uh, Forget it, Rosemary. It's alright. I'm telling you, it's fine, Rosemary. I feel all I've done so far is trouble you. Um, yeah. Actually, yeah. You're right. What? You're right. What? No. Yeah. Kesson, yeah. Kesson, what is this protagonist? Of? No. I mean, she broke into our home. Um, uh, yeah, Muffy. The protagonist is always nice, Kesson. You're, you're not following the rules of being the main character. The hero in Halo right now is really slipping off, let's be quite honest. It's, it's about to fall down off. It's about to fall no. off my head. <laughs> well, okay, no, she's already fallen off, but like, uh, <laughs> you can at least try. Well, she's brought into our house. She's she got tried, Muffy she to. She shot the girl into the house, into the attic. What? What are these accu I accusations still, coming from? I'm not gonna lie. I still don't she did. Muffy is now and thinking I, I that she we're. It, like, she's gonna spread the rumors around if we don't give her a piece of bread. She's blackmailing us. And now, she's gonna well, dump well, something like this. That's that's Muffy. That, that, I feel like I found something else. That's real. Oh, she would have been like, Ooh, I know those mangas in your bed. I'll tell everyone that you're yeah, a exactly. witch yeah. if you don't give me bread. Yeah, no, she'll find anything. She's desperate at this That point. broom right there? You're a witch. Is that how that <laughs> exactly, works? Is yeah. that how that works? Okay. First, seems like it. Mm. I don't know what people call them witches. Every, everybody's a witch. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> Which isn't a complete lie now, is it? Oh, see, at least. She's gonna set it herself. <laughs> yeah, sorry, sorry, Rosemary. I know you're looking at us with baby doll eyes, but it's, it's a bit true. Yeah, I do enjoy your company, so. Oh, I can't be mad at you for too long. Come on in here for a hug. <laughs> Anyhow, we ought to keep our story straight. Maybe if we tell them I came to lend you a hand with work. That's it, Rosemary. There you go. You're using your head. All right. All right. Listen carefully. Your grandmother is Granny Holly's auntie, the one that never came to visit. Okay. Okay. That's her story. That makes you my distant cousin of sorts. I don't think it's distant. Just a cousin. Just, just, just a cousin. I guess distant in the sense that we don't know each other. In that sense, because we're still very much. If she was the granddaughter, then she very much is blood. You see, yes. you came about to meet me, but yes, but we simply bumped into each other, and you asked me if I knew anyone named Holly. Okay. Sorry, I... I don't understand the least. How does that relate to what I said? Oh no, she's, she's going, she's going dumb again. <laughs> why you like to keep a break so much? Want, wait, why you like to keep a break so much? You want to stay and lend a hand? Oh, there you go. See, you're a kind, charitable, loving soul who wants wants to help with the festival. That'll keep them from asking too many questions out, waiting. I think that's a great idea, at least. All right. This being said, Rosemary, you're going to home right after nightfall, you hear? I don't want you hanging about these town folks too much, because they get real suspicious. Old Josh and, and Audley already accused me of being a witch, and they're about to throw me at the stake real soon. And same thing will happen to you. I don't you. think it says a lot. He might, he might as well just gave us the freaking hatchet and cut our head off at that point. He's basically signing our death warrant. Because you know what's going to happen if they find us we're a witch. Dead. Are you a witch? No. I'm being accused 
All right, Elise. I did it. We're making it happen right now. Let's let's go. Yes. Oh, she just disappeared. Oh, disappeared right in front of my eyes. <laughs> She's a witch. Witch. <laughs> Tea. Must be careful, Rosemary. These uh, folks are noisy and ill-tempered. Ill there, though. We don't want them want to make this situation any worse. Understood? Yes, Elise. I'll be good. You'll see. Oh, she's in my inventory. Well, not my inventory. She's in my party. <laughs> she's. I put her in like a little slot. Oh no. She's. She's in the inventory. You kidnap her. No. Oh no. She's. If I press T, she's. She's. No. Thought she works with child diaper. Child diaper. Uh no. At the same age. Which so happens to be the problem. Kidnapper! Anybody napper! Just stealing somebody! I wasn't reading what she was saying there, but... Hello, I need some food. Very hungry. Oh, I love you, little Gretel. Oh, Granny Gretel! I'm buying... Okay, um, I'm probably gonna get some more matches, because... I am a bit... broke. There you go, and I want to get some bread. So I only have three pieces. And then... Three pieces? That's all my money. I don't know how you're living off of three pieces of bread. Well, technically I'm gonna have six pieces. <laughs> I'm talking about per day, Kessie. Well, if they're like... If these are like... Well, we know how they look at... Well, if they're like this big pieces of loaves of bread, then... I think we can, if we ration them correctly, we can definitely survive with some water. So I don't think it would be like... I think we could definitely do it. Like in terms of like real life since like... And if they're like this big and not like like this big. They're this big. Almost, almost as big as her head right here. I think it's definitely um, doable. Wow. Yeah. I that's if it's that big. This, yeah, if that's the not... bread that you're buying specifically. If it's the little sticks back there, then mm. you're... The baguettes. <laughs> yeah, you should be there. <laughs> oh, well, you know. Yeah. Uh, no, no, I'm... No, See ya, Granny. Bye. I love Granny Gretel. She's so cute. Okay, so... That's... Where are we going? We're going back in town. Well, can we go back in that cave? Um, I'm a little scared to go back in there. Wait, what is this? What is this? What about you? Seen any witches about here? Watching solemnly over pass buyers. Or passers. No pass buyers. No passers by. Whatever. The Lord's image rests is etherealized in this wayside shrine. Can we go back in here? No, I think we cannot. It's broken. Can I get some berries? Can I go over here? I best not wander too far. No, I can't go here. Okay, I'm gonna go do my job so I can get money because I'm very poor. And I'll barely be able to survive. I love the yep. music. Okay, let's go. Oh, now I have to talk to more of these people. Oh, I regret talking to any of these people at this moment. <laughs> um, I need food. I'm kind of dying. I don't know the toy of course. What happens if you run out of hunger? Uh, it takes health, I think. Oh, and then wait. Wait a minute, so if you run out of hunger, then it starts taking you hell. Um, mm -hmm. then if you fill yourself, like, if you give yourself some food, then your health goes back up, right? Uh, no. Well, the certain- well, the bread only gives me hunger. Grapes give me, uh, food and hunger. And pretzels give me, uh, food. Wait, I say food and hunger? I'm sorry, it gives you health and hunger. Same for grapes. So grapes are equivalent to pretzels. That's why pretzels are a little bit more expensive because they give you health along with, um, what is it? The, uh, food? Yeah. 
So yeah. Okay. Uh, should I go inside the church? I'm pretty sure I have to talk to them. Hans. I don't know. Lep's here though. Ah, but who's this Elise? That look on her face means trouble, I can tell. Oh, good day. This is my cousin, Rosemary Leb. A cousin? My cousin, yes. She's a distant cousin from Primdorf. Lives to Granny Holly's auntie, you see. Dot, dot, dot. She doesn't look, she doesn't look um, or seem too convinced. Is my lying that bad? No, 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 no. Stick to the story, Elise. Keep it together. It's all in your head. Ah, I'm here for the festival. It's a pleasure to meet you, Rosemarine. I'm Leb. Oh, it's Rosemarine, actually. I think we've been saying her name all wrong, but I'm gonna keep saying I it. Said, I said, I said she, she keeps coming. Okay. Like, I call her Rosemarine because that's how they say it in here. But apparently that's wrong because she'd be like, it's Rosemarine. Rosemary. I don't know, she says it. Uh, Rosemarine. <laughs> Was, yeah, she said. Yeah, I guess you like pronounce it different. It's like it's like the plant, rosemary. Yeah, but it's her name is with the Z. It's not a C. And it has a Rosenmary, Rosa Rosa Marine, Rosa Marine. So it's like Rosen Marine. It's like my it's like my real name. Like people have different ways of typing. God, I hate names so much. Um, it's fallen into the habit of calling her Rose. Uh, so she calls her Rose, not Rose. Rose, Rose, with a S, not a Z. See what I'm saying? I don't know what I'm saying. People, people have a lot of different ways of saying things. That's all I'm gonna say. Yeah, it's, can't wrap my head around it. Might I have it. Language. <laughs> exactly. Not a habit, I didn't mean to call it. Has Elise shown you about town yet, Rosemarine? Ah, not yet. I only got here on Saturday and we've been at home mostly. Saturday? I didn't mean to introduce you two. I have no doubt, Elise. Oh, it's one of the little jelly. She knows, it's no use. She see, sees right through me. I spent most of my time here, Rosemary. Uh, you know where to find me. Ah, uh, thank you, Miss Leb. Oh, Leb, Leb is fine. Don't let at least work you too hard, you hear? Very funny, Leb. It's good okay. Nice. I probably should go to the top of the tower, because I don't know if there's anything actually here for me. Oh. Is there anything actually out here? Oh. I get to see the whole place. Nice. This place always brings me back such memories. The fragment uh, mountains, fra fragrant. Oh my god, fragrant mountain breeze frolics the about. Fragment mountains. I love my mountains and fragments. <laughs> frolics about <laughs> the rolling hills, spreading its spring cheer <laughs> all across Keeperburg. I never said I was good at reading. <laughs> it takes me a lot of courage to come here and, and read this. I could be like all these other streamers wait, wait, that just hey. don't read and just skip past it all. Wait, wait, what did you say? All the other streamers <laughs> and YouTubers. No, 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 no the other one. But, but you, you, what's it called? You read? Said it takes a lot of, what's it, takes a lot of, uh... Okay. Courage? It, yeah, it takes a lot of courage. This is your choice. <laughs> exactly. You you wanted to do this. Now he's forcing you to do this. Fine, I just won't read anymore. No, I want to read still. Because it helps me actually understand. <laughs> See, it, it, help, it literally helps me understand. I have to read it out loud. It helps me understand the story myself. If I don't read it, then I'm basically... I'm just looking at text move past me. Full of surprises today, aren't you, Elise? My, who's this lass? I'd like you to introduce you to my cousin from Primdorf. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Rosemarie. 
You don't mean to tell me Holly still has family in Premdorf. She she did, but Oh no. What do you know oh, about no. it anyhow? I feel like one of them definitely messed me up. I don't one might like give me answers, but I don't I don't know. I'm gonna go with this one. I wouldn't want to speak on Rosemary's behalf, but uh, my granny has passed, already passed, so I see. That's rather unfortunate. You're from a humble home, I can see that much. Mm. <laughs> Look at these bag. Look at these. Oh my secret. That is, that is wild. What is it, was it like? Hidden messages in the comments. Hey, look at those clothes. They're just so, um, unique. You know, you really have just a different fashion sense. And I think, you know... Uh, I was gonna say, what's the I was gonna say, oh, that's so unique. Have you ever tried anything else? Uh, <laughs> it's like, when somebody says, oh, is that a new shirt? And I'm like, you know that I'm... Okay, you've been paying attention to me. You're tired of the same crap I'm doing every day? Okay, I see, I see. Uh, I see you. I see what you're saying. Oh my god. It's these backhanded, like... Comments and compliments that really get you. Yeah. You come from a humble. <laughs> oh, oh, truly, I've always been rather free in the grass. Why aren't we from humble homes, Miss Bertha? Oh, trying to bring her down to our level. Yeah, right. That's right. You're just like us too. You're poor. You have to work for this bread. Like me. <laughs> Truly, Bertha, we hardly know the last. My people take offense to everything these days. <gasps> my suspicion went down, oh my god, it worked. It worked, it worked, it worked. Did I already talk to these people? I don't think so. So this is your cousin, Elise. Ah, uh, it's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Rosemarine. We were discussing the flower crowns for the festival, Elise. I had to make uh, one for Rosemary too. Oh, I wonder, I wouldn't want to trouble you. Don't be silly, Rosemary. We want you to feel welcome. Uh, be done with that scruffy hat of yours too. I was surprised to hear you had a cousin, Elise. Linda and Elizabeth here told me everything just now. I still don't quite understand how she came to He's be in Kieferberg, however. People still are suspicious. Stop being suspicious and just shut it. <laughs> ah, you see, I've always known I had an auntie named Holly in Kieferberg. I heard of um, the festival and decided to take my chance, is all. Oh, that is truly wonderful, Lass. Oh, but wasn't Holly, old Holly? Oh, would you look at the time? We're so busy. Oh, do you enjoy the festival? Oh, do enjoy the festival, dearie. Thank you. We're saved. A good thank you, Rosemary. Okay. Let's go down here. Maybe it's like old Holly here. Oh, there's different people here. Hello, who are you? I don't remember everyone. Oh, it's Elma. Taking pity on beggars now, are we? Oh! Elma. <laughs> you hear what she just said? That's, that's so the voice. Elma! I'm taking Elma. pity on beggars now, are we, Elise? <laughs> yeah, no, it's all. Yeah. Mm. Elma, don't worry. It's not very nice, but... Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's worse than what the other one said. Like, well, she's gone out and insulted her. There's no need to be so crude, Elma. This penny beggar, Miss Elma, happens to be my cousin. Ah, would you look at that, a cousin. I don't recall Holly having siblings, Elise. Of course she didn't. Can't you see the poor lass has lost her wits? Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> I was thinking about what she said, and I thought she was going to say next. I thought she was going to say next. Mm. Oh, I can see the resemblance. Oh, no. <laughs> I genuinely thought she was going to say that, and I was... <laughs> if you're already insulting us, don't need them to insult us anymore. <laughs> now they're saying I'm going crazy and everything. Elma, you need to calm down. 
You're being awfully rude. <laughs> Me? What about you, Elma? You're being rather unreasonable, Elma. Okay, so I've learned from my past mistakes that going off on these people and like saying, huh, so uh, look at yourself in a mirror and being witty and rude back is basically them accusing you of being a witch, which I find quite what? unreasonable. So if you, how does that, you, uh, how does that make you, if you argue back with them, you're a witch. You're a witch. Don't I worry. Argue all I want. You're a I witch. Burn him, burn, burn him, burn him. That's what's gonna happen. You're being rather unreasonable, Miss Elma. Giving Kieferberg such a bad reputation. Why you? I mean, you're the one throwing insults left and right, lady. Truly, Elma. And you weren't helping the case. You, you kind of helped us a little bit in the beginning, then you kind of just kind of went off the rails, too. <laughs> Not trying to go off the rails. Exactly. I must say, there's no no way to welcome Elma's cousin. Elma? Uh, Elise is... Ooh. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry. I feel... I feel I've been a bother. Not at all, lass. I apologize for this altercation. Allow me to introduce you. This is my cousin, Rosemarie. Rosemarie. Because I'm going to say it the same way. Alright, oh, I'll acknowledge that. That was rather unfortunate for of me. Unfortunate of you? Hmm. Okay. What did she say? Okay. Uh -huh. Don't wanna take the the blame when it's due. Just say sorry and move on. Can't even say sorry. Nope, not on her real cabinet. Just like me. Welcome to Kieferberg, Rosemarine. Thank you. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, what's going on in here? <laughs> just like you do. X fire I'm very what is it um I'm not gonna say transparent uh what is it understanding of my character uh -huh. <laughs> so as understanding about my character I should probably do better to change my character <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say <laughs> what's it called I remember when we were doing a little this is before the stream and stuff let <laughs> me drink some you're just like hot chocolate oh, what you're talking I remember he did that. Mm. And I just, and I just now, now hearing this now is very ironic. <laughs> yeah, we I did I did call people for, not like real people, yep. but <laughs> no 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 no. Was it real people? No no. I don't I don't remember. <laughs> I don't remember. I don't remember. I don't remember who I was calling for. <laughs> I'm like boy, old, boy. <laughs> Oh no, he doesn't- Oh no! I don't remember who I was- I don't remember who I was telling that to. <laughs> oh no. It was- it's all a blur. I'm pretty sure you said it to both NPCs and people in Roblox. Well, they deserved it probably. I don't even remember who used to live here. It's uh, it's in its cozy nook. The old house- old home waits. Wilts. Wilts waits to be consumed by the overgrowth. Okay, who is this? What's going on in here? Oh, it's Groon. Ah, it's you. The kooky lass. These children. These children. You know, Goon, that's not something you'd usually... You're ugly, Elise. You're ugly. Hold up. Whoa. Whoa. Isn't she supposed to like the sweetheart? Like the adorable sweet child? Yes, like the, sweet... The sweet ones always have a dark like, she's supposed to be like the good one compared to her brother. Now she's gonna throw an insults left and right. Whoa. Why? Why you? Is this your cat groom? She's Miss Linda's. Her name's Lila. Oh, that's such a sweet name. Say, kooky lass. It's Rosemary Groom. Why is there a scarecrow on your shop? Uh, sc shawl? Shawl? Rosemarine? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Shall? Shall? Don't know. Oh, this? Word. My grandmother made it for me when I was just about your age. I keep it with me um, always because she isn't with me anymore, you see. 
Oh, I'm sorry. That's quite alright, Groom. Since when are you good with children, Rosemary? That... Well, we don't really know her very well, so... Well, first of all, I she already said that she's like, Oh yeah, I do play the kids. So clearly she's not paying attention. <laughs> Number one. <laughs> Number two. She's never seen her with kids, so she wouldn't know. Yeah, exactly. she doesn't know her very much. You're, you're an ugly old crone, Elise. Why? Why? <laughs> These children! And this game is so rude! I mean, in real life too, but... You should learn- you should learn from your cousin. Wow, that's she's lecturing us about how we should learn from our cousin. Maybe Elise at one point was just like, I'm not gonna pick you, child. <laughs> and then she the, she's been put on the hit list for all children. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah, she's been put on the hit list for everybody. All of them want to hunt her down. Yeah, she's gone. <laughs> Why you she's little? Gone, gone. Oh, she's gone. <laughs> uh, green. Maybe then your big nose will shrink and become nice and tiny Ooh. like mine. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, she's going in. <laughs> Now, now, Groon. El Elisa's nose isn't that pointy. Mm. <laughs> You're not helping. I think, I think, I think she's playing with the child. Like, oh yeah, ha 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 ha. That's it. <laughs> That's it. We're leaving. I'm not taking this insults. You people just hurt my feelings. <laughs> Rosemary. Hmm. <laughs> You're welcome to come play with me whenever you'd like. Oh, you're too kind, Groom. Oh, kind? This wasn't the word I would use. Goodbye. <laughs> it's not the word I would use, personally. True, you would have used that one word that is not very nice to kids. <laughs> I don't remember. Not very good Wait, is it the word we just said? The, the P word? That, mm, I don't think it was that. that Hmm. Wait, what word? Anyways, Wait, what word would I say? I don't I'm even know. What word would I say? I don't even know. No, no, no. I'm trying to figure out what word it is too. No, keep it then. Keep it then. Oh god. Why does it look like she's cross-eyed? Oh my god. Audibly. I think it's just because it's just looking in a certain direction. Okay, whatever. Oh, how dreadful. You're making a bigger deal of this than you ought to, um, ought to of Audily. What now? Audily here has caught wind of your cousin, Elise. Heard from Primdorf, lass? Heard you from Primdorf? Ah, yes, from a nearby village, in truth. And your... She's the granddaughter of Granny Holly's auntie, Miss Audily. You've heard of her, I'm certain. I suppose Old Holly did spend quite some time in Primdorf, from what I recall. That's what I've be, been trying to tell you. I must say, I'm still trying to figure out how, how, how exactly. I'm still trying to figure out exactly how you two met, Elise. Oh, we met by chance. Ah, but that's quite different from what you. Rosemary uh, Granny told her about me a long time ago, you see. Yes, I came here in hopes of finding my relatives. We bumped into each other by the crossroad last Saturday. She asked me if I knew someone named Holly. Now that's a story worth telling, lass. Thank you for encouraging us to lie more. Ah, yes. I see. Did you hear that old ho- uh, ho- oddly? There's no need to fret. She's about to go. She's foaming at the mouth right now. She's going crazy. She's going feral. <laughs> She's not believing the story at all. She's about to jump on both of us. <laughs> she is not eating up your story. Yeah, she's like, mm, what is this? Get out of my face. <laughs> I don't want this. Disgusting. <laughs> Disgusting. <laughs> all right. Well, welcome to Kieferberg, I suppose. Whenever one says something like, I suppose, usually means they're not fully on board. It's like, oh my god, you're so cute, I suppose. <laughs> oh, look at that shirt, so stylish, I suppose, in a different world. 
Thank you, it's a pleasure to be here. Okay, we're finally done with these people being so mean to us. Okay, we gotta talk to everyone. Oh, there's more people. Oh. Other than her suspecting Rosemary, I don't think it's just you. I think it's just you. I mean, look at yeah, Rose. Yeah, a lot of these seems a lot of these seems to be targeted toward you, not Rosemary. Yeah, the show, especially the children, apparently. No, no, they hate her. Oh yeah, they just loathe Elise for some reason. And then the the, the mean girls, they got it out for Elise as well. <laughs> <laughs> the mean girls. Well, actually, the old mean girls, because they're old. Oh. I call them girls, but they're they're very old. Old ladies. Old! There's the famed cousin. <laughs> we heard all about her from... Irene. I think you say her name. I still... Uh, I change her name every time. Allow me to introduce you to Mr. F uh, Finn. Mr... Goldale? I don't know how to say this guy's name. Goldale? Gold <laughs> you said what? Wait, Mr. Oh. Uh. Goodoo. 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 Uh, uh Goodoo. <laughs> this is my cousin, Rosemary. Ah, it's a pleasure to meet you. Just in time for the festival, aren't you, lass? Oh, I've been hearing all about it. Make certain you uh, make the most of it while you're here. Rosemary is going to be helping me with work all week. Making your cousin work for her stay at least. Someone has to feed her and uh, the economy once again. One piece of bread is already $10. Crazy expensive, you know? We don't all have, have stable jobs. Don't surprise, doesn't surprise you in the least, does it? No, at least it's very kind. It was a joke, Lass. Oh. You're very welcome in Kieferberg. Rosemary. It's Rosemary. It's time to go. We have much to do. Okay, let's go up to the nice good old wind. Oh no. There's these people. Oh, what do you have me to do? Okay, I'll talk to you in a second. I want to see what's up here. Well, I already know what's up here, but I didn't want me to talk to you. Um, I don't think so. Wait, who am I meeting? It's at dusk, it's right? It's at dusk. Uh, yes, at dusk. You may need to reset your what's it called? Your microphone really quick. It's doing a little buzzy thing again. It's doing buzz stuff? I just realized, <laughs> yeah. I checked the stream and I was like, ah, I can hear a little buzz. Still doing it? Uh, well, it started doing it again. It's doing buzz? Uh, if you unplug it and plug it back in, sometimes that works. Okay, let me yeah, see. Okay, I literally have to unplug my mic. Okay, let's, I think everything is fine. We're fine. Hopefully it wasn't going on for too long. Hopefully not. If it was, then... Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Don't know what to say. Okay, what kind of job do you have over here? Ah, there you are. Your cousin, is it? It's a pleasure to meet you. She came all the way from Primdorf. Primdorf? That's a long way from here. Ah, truly. I was thinking of asking you to collect me some eggs. Oh, God. The flashbacks. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, no. I mean, this seems to keep getting beaten up by... Uh, by... Well, quite literally chickens. Ah, uh, okay. Um... Should I do it? Yeah, sure, I'll, I'll do the, the eggs. Can they can bite my fingers off. Okay, but like... You don't... You don't need me. Mm. You got rosemary. Rosemary, come... 
Come with me and lend me a hand. Will she actually help me? Oh. Out of my way, you feathered maybe, rat. Maybe she's doing the other one. Maybe she'll get an A. Does she actually help me? Oh my god. She does. She's right there. Wait. She's right there. <laughs> okay. And pick it up with E. Shush, shush, shush. Oh no, she's not here. She lied. No. She's not helping. She's not helping at no, all. Don't worry. Just, just wait. This way. She'll be there. No. Oh. Oh, fudge. Give me the eggs. Oh, I'm getting kind of better at this. Oh, God. Stop moving. Okay, okay, okay. I need a little warm up. I'm getting better. Still pretty bad, but getting better. Okay. Get off the eggs. Oh, shoot. So bad at this. I was able to get three this time. Oh. Okay, how many did I get? I don't, I don't know. It's all, it's all a blur at this point. 30. That's a B. I'm not trying this again, because I don't think I'll actually be able to do better. No. No, never again. <laughs> never. You pass! Yay! Yay, chickens. Here, I thought two people would get more. How about you? Show it to your mail. And get them yourself. <laughs> My fingers are hurting. Roman's ring is quite, uh, not quite used to it, Mr. Wilhelm. Uh -huh. That's all right, Elise. Here you go. You still, you two still did a good job. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Mr. Uh, uh, Eugene. There we go. So we're calling him. So now we have to go meet. Freya at the well, I believe. Hmm. It's best you head on now, Rosemarine. Folks had a, uh, had had enough of you for one day. <laughs> oh, it was so so much fun, Elise. If you say so. I'll see you at home then. I think that she enjoyed her time with her. Yeah. Okay, so now... I could do more tasks, but... Literally, I'm not going to have to, because I got to go read, uh, talk to Leb. Oh, what are you doing here? What are you doing? It's you. It's pretzel time, Elise. Oh, mm, I think I should have a pretzel. Her goodness oh, spare me, Maggie. What? Her name is changing every time. Now it's Maggie. It's getting so far off. Mm. I've waited all day, Elise. You promised me a pretzel. Hmm. I promise you no such thing. Oh, I'm telling Father Hans then. Just you wait. Wait, wasn't the whole thing basically about her like keeping them away from like, her like not telling them about um, Rosemary being there? So every, now that everyone knows, yeah. like it would probably be a lot. Doesn't really matter much, but oh no, she can spread rumors because these people clearly still do talk. Just you wait. Good luck with that, Mindy. I've always already introduced her to everyone myself. Oh my. Oh my, oh, oh my beggar cousin Rosemary. Her eyes sparkle as she says that too. They'll fall right for it, every single one of them. She's not your cousin. Golly, Elise, even I fell for it. Oh no, Elise, she's, she's just gonna said. <laughs> 
when you disclose your lie like that. Oh god. No, 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 you've got it all wrong. What I meant was, I do my best, let those folks know, huh? Okay, we finally got the leverage, like, the blackmail was gonna stop. And then we just give her more, more ammunition. Why? Oh, if only you'd give me a pretzel. Oh god, I... It's my only pretzel, man. My only pretzel. Oh monster. I'm taking my pretzel, it's so expensive. You keep your wretched mouth shut, or else. Dare tell a soul about any of this, and you're good as dead. That's what I thought. Oh, and it's fresh too. We got that like a day ago, so if you call that fresh, but okay. You're so generous, Elise. All right. Are you? Are we clear, Muffy? Mm -hmm. As long as you give me some grape juice tomorrow. Where do we get grape juice from? Muffy. So I can drown you in it. Got it. I best uh, make certain I keep some aside for her tomorrow. First off, where do we get this grape juice from? You see, you get grapes, Cousin, and then you squeeze them. I have grapes, but I gotta figure out what the grape juice is. What, can, what, can I find somewhere to, like, do it? You, you give her the least amount of grape juice that you can. You squeeze one grape to a cup. Pour water in it. Oh, so, yeah. oh, oh, okay. <laughs> They're ten each. Hey. Come on. Oh, you can have that. Oh, God. Yeah. Um, I don't want to spend all my money. This is why I'm saying I only need one. My sanity. My sanity is already, like, pretty low. No, I should save up for, like, the good old Saint Old Pargo oil. That's really good. Because yeah, for some reason, like, even if you sleep, your sanity doesn't go up, from what I can see. Yeah. Might as well top it off, I guess, and just get two more matches. I would say. I thought that I thought that she already knew that she wasn't your cousin, so I was like, ah. Oh. He said what? I thought she already knew that she wasn't your cousin, so I was just like, ah, oh. yeah, she's just like, huh? Apparently not. She's a gullible as the rest. True. Ah. Uh, I like to talk to the rest of these misfits. You can't be straining yourself like that, Mariel. Is everything alright? Oh, Matilda's making too much of it, Elise. It's an awful lot of work, Matil uh, Mariel, and you're not as young as you used to be. Oh, but what uh, would I be doing with my time if not lending a hand for the festival? I'm slower than I was in my, in my youth, but I can still help. You can always uh, share some of your workload with Freya, Miss uh, Muriel. I could, I couldn't even lend, uh, lend a finger. Not with this much uh, tr trimmer of mine. Oh, we aren't what we used to be, are we, Matilda? I, I think Matilda and Muriel were like the best friends of um, of our, our Granny Holly, basically. The three of them were like. Sisters, basically, from what I remember. Oh, the oh, the downgraded. Yeah. What? Hmm? Wait, what? Nothing. Uh huh. Continue. That we're not old lass. Talk about how they're old they are. Okay. Hello. A summer child would uh, do you no good, anyhow. And you, Elise. What about me, Miss Brunhild? Old Holly brought her from brought her to Kieferberg in the summer, I believe. She told me I was born a few weeks after the summer solstice. How are you to know when you are born? Granny Holly ought to uh, have known, Miss Lorelei. You were adopted to be fair, but... Oh, but weren't you here? Weren't you brought here as a baby? She was, so 
I suppose old Holly can't, couldn't have been wrong. I can't say it's very polite of you to be discussing such things. Oh, I'm sorry, Elise. I was asking them about the townsfolk. With my baby coming and everything. My, you always take everything so seriously, Elise. These people. Oh no, oh no. You can probably see this is trouble. Old Josh and Anne freaking oddly is here. Oh no. One of them is bad, but both of them in the same place? Jesus, it's about to go down. Oh, that windstorm was a dreadful thing. We're still talking about the windstorm, okay. I see, I, uh, I see we're still blabbering on about the windstorm. Tell me about it, Elise. You two ought to take this very seriously. Old Stefan warned us. On his deathbed, no less. That's why we can't trust his word, old Joshin. Old Stefan passed too early, that's what. Maybe you two should I go along with him. Oh, no. <laughs> Not this ridiculous. Let old Stefan rest. I won't... Not this ridiculous nonsense like... again. I feel like... Let him rest would be like a good thing, cause like let him just be dead. Yeah, I mean they rest pretty bad. Um, I'll be honest. Um, but yeah. But this one's like more respectable, I would say, cause they keep bringing uh, up. Yeah, a... no, I don't, I don't know too yet. Not like this one, cause let let he's, he's already gone. We can remember him. Talk about him still. Yeah, but only keep bringing them up every uh, second because nonsense like a witch. So I want to say I'm gonna say the first one. What was uh, what was it he said what, that was so important anyhow? Nonsense, at least that's ooh, what. Ooh. You foolish folks will never learn. It's only natural you don't know, at least. You were young. Old Stefan warned us about uh, of us. Oh goodness. Old Stefan warned us of the arrival of the witch, no less. Then that Kiefenberg would undergo many trials that we would all. Oh, for goodness sake! Starting to sound like old. Starting to sound like Elise, Marion, Marilyn, because Elise does say um, "for goodness sake" a lot. What's that supposed to mean, you? It's best we uh, walk away, lass. These folks will never learn. Yes, yeah, suspicion went down. Yeah. So I picked it right. I will so. say, I was gonna question why is Elise helping this random person? Because she doesn't seem to be like too happy with them staying. And then I remembered, oh, it's because she wants a house. <laughs> yeah, a maid. I forgot. Yeah. Oh, here's little mumpkins. Well, I don't want to talk to these children. <laughs> Let's go home, Alf. Mama told us we ought to be home before nightfall today. The sun's still high, Grun. Stop whining. You ought to listen to your mother, Alf. I don't want to go home yet. Alf. It seems Miss Elizabeth is... Elizabeth's in a bit of a temper today, Elise. Miss Elizabeth's in a temper? Miss Dorothy was also in a temper. That's because you refuse to read, Elf. Even I can read better than you. No, you don't, liar. I do too. You're the, only, you're the one who's best at reading, aren't you, Jacob? And with numbers too. You got to lend a hand these uh, these two bird brains a hand here. Leave, Elise. You're ugly. Okay. 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 When you were listening in on a child's conversation. What do you mean listening in? I was talking to them. I'm in the conversation. These, these... We were talking to a bunch of children that have called you up. So that was, only, that was only gonna end poorly, I feel like. It's always... The, the little twins. I'm assuming they're twins. Uh, that's a good problem to have, lad. Is everything alright, Mr. Gustav? Uh, Eugene here will uh, have his hands tied with his uh, business all week. It's a matter of when 
where to do it, truth be told. The horses will need some rest, that's for certain. For all we know, we might have to pull those carts ourselves. Let's make certain I keep busy tomorrow then. You uh, need to uh, feed up a lot of pig roasts before you uh, be carrying a single log at least. Oh, you need to be fed. Oh, okay. Mm. This is a make her nice, big, and strong. Then, <laughs> yeah. He's right, Elise. You ought to make sure you keep yourself healthy. Well, if you want to give me some food instead of just bread, that'd be cool too. Protein is nice, you know. The vegetables. I don't know. All I'm getting is grain. <laughs> you got the cash for it, kiddo? Is that what? You got the cash for it, kiddo? <laughs> kind of doesn't look like you have it. Yeah, it's, uh, that's what they're saying, though. It's saying one thing, but not their their actions aren't really they're helping. They're giving a solution, but they're not giving. They're not. They're not helping. Yeah. Yeah, we're very poor here. Everybody likes to be part of the problem. Yep. Yeah. Love the problems. I'm stronger than I look, Miss Eugene. Old age doesn't wait for anyone, Elise. Eat plenty. <laughs> Eat plenty. And don't work yourself into the ground, you hear? Once again, no one's helping us pay those those bills. Well, there's not really any bills. Just food. Bread is still expensive. Hello. On your way home, Elise? Not yet, Miss Linda. Say, have you gone, got any cheese or milk from Elizabeth? No, I haven't. Her goats have fallen ill, you see. So they talked about something about her goats falling ill before, so I'm assuming that's going to be a problem later on. Witch! Witch! The witch did it! Is what's going to happen, most likely. She stopped by earlier to take uh, back the cheese I got her, got from her. She said it was best we don't eat it. I see. Well, she's a good person. Some people would have just been like, old nasty cheese? Oh, I know someone, someone will get it. I still need my money, so here you go. Take it. It's good that there's people out there that will take the cheese back because they don't smart. want people to get sick <laughs> from it. Smart. Lord knows what's wrong with her goats. Oh, I wouldn't forgive myself if my boys fell ill. I'm certain Miss Elizabeth didn't mean any harm, Miss Linda. Well, of course she didn't. She took the cheese back. Of course not, Elise. What a thing to say. These things happen, but you see... No, I don't think I do, Miss Linda. I often wonder if Elizabeth's husband was still with us. Miss Linda? Oh, you know, I... I know. Let's pretend I didn't say anything that Elise. Oh yeah, those two little children, the little blonde ones, little monsters. Uh, their father is no longer with us. Her mother is a single, a single parent. Sad to say. I talked to these two shenanigans. Shenanigans? Did I? Where's your cousin headed? Home already? No, I haven't talked to these two. She had her fill of Kiefer Bird for one day, is all. A heaven sent Elise. That's what she is. It's not every day you discover a cousin, is it? I must say, I'm glad you're no longer on your own, lass. Uh, I suppose you're right, Mr. Finn. Now, it would be crazy, because she said it'd be a love interest. Gotta tell everyone this is not your cousin, because, you know, if you want to get with her. <laughs> it's going to be a bit weird. Mm -hmm. Just saying. Mm -hmm. Of course, he's right, at least. Family is what's most important. And it, always full of cheer, aren't you? That's what logging does to you, making you cheerful. Yeah. Working with Gustav have, uh, what keeps you keep us in good spirits, I'd say. The lad has more cheer than all the Kieferberg and Primdorf combined. It must run. It must run in the family, wouldn't you say? Freya could very likely run the festival all by herself, don't you agree? Logging included, no doubt. I waited she could carry an entire cart of logs all the way to Kieferberg. What is she, a horse? 
Yep. So I guess you can carry all these logs. True. Okay. Let's go over here. I don't think we need to talk to anyone. Oh, what's this? These would be for the festival, I wager. Several rolls of fabric sit tucked away by the use to be used for the festival's various stalls and bunting. Okay. There's no one over here. I think I finally talked to all these people. I think I can finally go. So I need to go and talk to Freya, because I can't. Unless I would love to help get more chickens, which I don't. I need to go for Freya. Mm -hmm. She's okay. at the well. Yeah, how do I, I get, I'll go up here to look at the well, right? Wait. Let me make sure. Uh. No, it's 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 down, it's down here to get to the well. Okay, that's why I got to the very wrong place. Okay, let's go. Okay, hello Freya. There she is. I'll spend some time with her. Oh, it's wonderful! Oh, at least they're wonderful. <laughs> they suit me rather well, don't they? I was talking about the shoes. Oh, well, I guess. Hmm. I don't know. Huh? They they look very similar to their old ones. Supposedly, witch lady. Who? The, the people, like the eyes, the eyes, look there. Oh, they're golden eyes. They've all got golden eyes. <laughs> Maybe they are cousins. They suit me rather well, don't you? Don't you think? Your legs are so long. It's like you were made for those shoes. Or the shoes were made for that's, you, maybe. But it's a very different thing. <laughs> yes, you're exaggerating, Freya. <laughs> Nothing of the sort, at least. You're so elegant. All the compliments are coming out. We needed that after what those people have been saying about Freya. Not Freya. Elise and, um... No, actually, they haven't really said much about Rosemary. They've just been saying everything to Elise. No, there was, there was Wilma. Wilma has been saying some nasty well, things. Well, well, well. <laughs> <laughs> huh? I always thought you were so elegant, even when you were younger. Freya! I'm more of a farm uh, land lass, you see? <laughs> made me a chop made to chop wood and draw water from the well. I wanna put it like that, Freya. Okay, you're different Elise. You're so confident and, and posed. Oh uh, yeah. Not one of these folks would ever agree with you, Freya. You always know when to stand your ground and what to say. Not wrong, I'm a pretty good talker in there at all. You got that right. Which is what gets me in trouble to begin with. Not also very true. I can't help but admire the way you carry yourself, Elise. Freya! You're truly... I wish I were as brave as you. Huh? I could never talk back to Miss Wilma, or to anyone else for that matter. Well, you're just too sweet is all. You're a little too forgiving, that's true. That's why they keep praising me left and right, I suppose. She is called like the Edwards of Evergreen Sweetheart after all. What's keeping you from speaking your mind, Freya? <laughs> oh, I'm too much of a chicken for that, Elise. I want to say I, wa I don't want to say you're ne you'll never change, huh? Because I feel like that's a bit condescending. Maybe it's me being looking into it a little too much. I'm gonna be like, I'm gonna. Are you out of your mind? Because it's kind of like you can change. <laughs> You lost your wits, and it's only Monday. Huh? Who's to tell you what you can or cannot do? 
Actually, uh, a lot of people have put away Kenny Kenobi. Uh, <laughs> no murdering, <laughs> no shoplifting, no vehicle manslaughter. Like, <laughs> oh my god. If there's, if there's no manslaughter, well, uh, no manslaughter is a, a recommendation. It's not a... Come on, we can always do it. Yeah. He's gonna stop me. He's gonna stop me. Okay, I made sure the string was still going on because I was looking at something and it looked like the string was off. And that kind of <laughs> threw me off for a second. I was like, huh? Hold up. Okay, uh, is that good right there? Okay, there we go. It's not as though I'm, I can simply start. Only it's true, only, wait. Only it truly is that simple, Freya. You're so capable and gifted. Oh, sweet moment. I know how much you love this town, but even you have to admit, all it does is hold folks back. I know, Elise. Yet I can't seem to get to the bottom of it. Kimberberg is my home, after all. It's not as though you can't build a home someplace else, Freya. This is where my father is, where you are. It's... It's where my memories of my mother are, too. Freya. I've thought about Primdorf, or even going beyond that, but... I must say, I'm glad to be here at this moment, right here where I am. Please. With you, Kiefer and Kieferberg. Ah, oh, the blushes! The blush! Aren't you, Elise? You do make me more bearable, I suppose. Kifferberg wouldn't be the same to me without you, if I'm honest. Freya. You're truly... Mm. Capable and gifted. Heard you the first time, Elise. <laughs> Freya! <laughs> Why you? Say, so I'll be home all afternoon tomorrow. I'll be there. <laughs> For goodness sake. Oh, that was a touching moment. <laughs> touching! <laughs> oh, let me um, put this on the charger. It's about to go dead. Dead? I was dead. I love you, Nabu. Chat. Okay, there you go. What, what are you saying? Oh, uh, <laughs> mm -hmm. huh? What are you about to what? say? Here, here, leave, leave, leave for a second. Uh huh. I'm gonna say something to the chat if you. Okay, well, thank you, love. Well, if you guys enjoyed the stream, like and subscribe. That's gonna say. Now, yes, that's what I want to hear. Uh, so oh, I just, I just got uh, back. Oh, forget sorry. I know, uh, I just got forget back. No. Yeah, no, 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 no. Unsubscribe. No. Oh. <laughs> no. <laughs> I need more. <laughs> Let me do this thing. Thank you. I need to put that match on because it's too, too freaking dark in here. Oh, listen. You hear the music at night? Yeah. Oh, it's the golden, golden girl. Oh, last. It's the Golden Girls. The Golden Girls, the show. Um, <laughs> the show. Yeah. Oh, last. To think I would be surrounded by demons on my deathbed. Your deathbed? That fateful evening, I was taken to his dwelling under the pretense of glory. What do you mean? His it's blessing. His blessful word. You ought, to, you ought to believe any of it. Oh. Oh my god, I got Walparga well, oil. Oh my god, thank you. Oh my god, she's truly... Oh. My sanity, my sanity just dropped a handful. I uh. mean, I assume we just talked with the ghost, so... 
Well, she's golden. She's a golden girl. My too. sanity would drop down a lot. She's a I golden should... girl. She could never do anything bad. That mm. I don't think there's anyone we need to talk to. <laughs> I don't think we need to talk to anyone. So I'm gonna assume that I'm good. So I'm, I'm gonna do like a little exploration to make sure everything is good and fine. Everything seems fine. Can I go inside of here? Oh my god, I can go inside of here. Oh my god, I didn't know this. That's wild. Hi there, horses. Hi there, piggies. Oh my god, the pigs looking this look so cute. The horses look really buff. I mean, look at they, all the defining features on them. Like, they look like they're about to just pump out. I don't know if you've ever seen that episode of... Well, actually, it doesn't really kind of go well, but it's the time that, uh, episode in Adventure Time when that horse literally was stealing a bunch of citizens from the Candy Kingdom, and he took off his hoof. He took off his hoof and it was a hand, and he was, like, taking them. It was so weird. I remember the episode so... So, it was so... Oh my gosh, she scared me. At one point in time, I would watch it. The, 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 there's, a, there's a lot of episodes. There are a lot of episodes, I'll tell you that much. I, I, forget, time to I forget how many seasons there are. My, you'll get another earful staying in town until this late, at least. Isn't it quite late for you, too, Miss Matilda? Oh, dearie. Mornings were never my favorite. Your grandmother shared the sentiment, didn't she? She did take her time going to bed, that's true. Old Holly truly was full of surprises and secrets. Secrets, Miss Matilda? Why, yes, Gretel and I were always wondering what was on her mind. She was quite withdrawn at times, you see. I suppose she was, yes. Gretel was the only one she'd confined in. Lep's Gren... Granny does talk about her a great deal, that's for certain. You can't take old Joshin's foolery to heart, Elise. No, no, I don't. He's crazy. You lasses are different from when I was your age. And that's what the and that's the way it ought to be. Maybe your elders weren't as narrow minded as Miss Matilda. Oh my gosh. The people nowadays, these these crazy old people. The freaking Crazy! Oh, you wouldn't know, dearie. Okay, I don't think I need to go this way. I think I need to get out of town. <laughs> get out of town. Uh, there's so... only room for the two of us. <laughs> only room for the two of us. I don't think there's anything down here. Question mark? No. This cat and the there are so many alley cats and dogs. That's insane. The cats and dogs everywhere. Can I go inside of here? It's raining cats and dogs. It has to be with this many in here. It's raining cats and dogs. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's, it's raining right right tacos. It's raining cats and dogs. Nom, nom, nom. Oh god. <laughs> No, oh no, actually. Wait a minute. <laughs> yeah, what, what, what? Why do you say numb? No reason. Oh, no. I think I know why some of them have been, been going missing. Oh, no. <laughs> no, no, no. God, on your way home, at least. You off this topic. Quite late, I'm aware. <laughs> Our fellas are out on patrol for a reason, lass. I'm still not certain it's for a good reason, if I'm honest. Me too, Mr. Gustav. I must say I'm quite... I don't quite see the use for it. Gustav here just doesn't want to make the rounds, I think. I'd say getting a good night's sleep would do us all better, is all. Old Joshin's preaching does more harm than good. He could be right, for all we know. 
I struggle to fear something I haven't yet seen Wilhelm. Truly, there's no such thing as a witch. My only comfort is knowing that, knowing it'll keep Freya well rested. You too, Elise. You and your cousin can sleep comfortably tonight. Oh, thank you. Okay, I think it's time to leave. Actually, do I need to eat? Because I probably should. I, yeah. Probably should probably eat some bread. Maybe. I'll eat one more. There we go. It's got for you all down. Hmm. There's only two pieces. Calm down. <laughs> you have none for tomorrow. Call. What are you calling me, fat? <laughs> hey, I never said that. Uh huh. I never said that. Don't start, Leb. I'm not explaining myself again. My lips are sealed. You can stand here looking at me all you want. She's a rather sweet lass, I must say. Leb? I know you, Elise. She's my cousin, there's nothing more to it. You thought you're trying to convince yourself more than freaking Leb. Oh, could you say that again? She's, um, you know. No, I don't know, Elise. That's why I'm asking. Now that we got that out the way, won't you tell me who she is? She's, she says she's a traveler. I found her hiding in my granary on Saturday. A traveler? I'm not convinced either, Lep, but I felt sorry for the poor lass. She says she'll be leaving right after the festival, so it's only temporary. What has she come here to do? She won't tell me much herself. I didn't know attentions of bringing her to Kieferberg, but she graced us with her presence, I suppose. I had to think of something right there and then. Elise. I shouldn't be housing a stranger, let alone put myself in harm's way for her, but... Is she just talking outside of a house, or is that her house? Uh, I don't think so. No, I think she's on the, um, the swing, on the tree swing. Oh, no. I think she lives in the church. I don't know where she actually lives. She doesn't look very honest. alive, I'll be honest with you. You said what? She doesn't look very alive, I'll be honest with yeah, you. Yeah, like the um, the moonlight right here is making her look very suspicious. <laughs> just be suspicious, just be suspicious. Yeah, I understand at least. Oh, Leb. I also understand what you're telling me is a half-truth. At best. Here's your bread. You'll let me know if you need more, won't you? Lev is so nice. Even though we're literally telling her half the truth, she's still like... We're still friends. Or something more, if you know what I mean. No, I don't know. Two pieces of bread? Oh my god. Oh my, Lev. Forget all these other girls. You might be the one. I trust you right, all the same. Do you just want her for the money, or do you want her because she's nice? Because she's nice to me, and I won't have to work as hard with these chickens. So, is it because she's nice to you, or is it because of the money, Justin? <laughs> Which one? You don't have to help me, Lab. You know that. <laughs> yeah, here I am. Look at me, Elise. I do trust you. I need you to know that. All right. Stay out of trouble now. I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you, Lab. I love you. Mm. She doesn't mean it. Okay. Oh my god, I can go inside here now. I wonder if there's something in there, in that windmill. I don't know what that was about, or what that thing was, but... What I saw in there was a ritual of sorts. There's no doubt about it. Okay, I need to go to the windmill. You know, before I... Excuse me? <laughs> they said there's a ritual. Hmm. I'm gonna I'm say, I'm just I'm in I'm case I'm things... I'm things don't go so well. <laughs> Sorry, are you alright? Don't need the exercise for you? Harmonica, 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 harmonica. Harmonica. What the? 
<laughs> or someone trying to say ritual words and they're just saying harmonica. <laughs> he wants to give you a harmonica? Harmonica, harmonica. Okay, here's his. <laughs> here's a harmonica. Harmonica! <laughs> Starts playing a harmonica. Here's the old windmill. This is where I was supposed to be. What am I what am I doing here? What, what does it want me to do? <laughs> Break into the window. I'm here. Break your legs up there. It's old. I've already looked at this place before. Maybe it's not out of reach. I'm not quite sure I believe this nonsense though. Shining in the distance, the monumental castle stands a fairy animal very well out of reach. I'm not gonna talk about how the I messed that up, but you know. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I want to finish this day before I end the stream off because last stream I like ended off really early. Hmm. Oh my. Scared me. Sitting right there. Hello. Oh, there's Flock. Hi, Flock. Seems like you're doing stuff now. Not taking my bed sheets. Elise. Oh, there you are, Elise. It's quite late, isn't it? For sake. Spare me the earful, Rosemarine. What's the? What's there to sweep out here after nightfall, anyway? Uh, I'm sorry. Oh. I was keeping myself busy until you came home, is all. And Flock here was amusing himself chasing after the broom. Flock. Weren't you, Flock? Oh, look a little Flock. What's, what's for supper then? Yes. Oh, I made grape soup. What? Yeah. Grape soup. <laughs> she may have some. She may. She made us some grape soup. Next part. Hmm. I will eat that. No, doesn't it sound lovely? Come, come. You get the first cool. bite. You get the first bite. It's made just with yeah. love. And for you, too. I'm allergic to love. Sometimes love can be poison. Uh, I mean... <laughs> soup? Yeah, we're all, we're all getting the same expression here. Okay. I figure we... <laughs> I figured we could uh, both use something hearty. Hearty? I would never put grapes in the same category as hearty. Maybe like a turkey. Thanksgiving turkey is a hearty meal. What do you mean it's, it's a hearty? Yeah. Okay. We have. Mm, mm. We have eggs. What about the eggs? I cook those too. In the in the soup? Oh, Rosemary, you shouldn't have. <laughs> I thought we could toast some of yesterday's breads with them. Oh. Oh thank goodness. I'm sorry, but... Did I do something wrong? No, 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 no. Eggy toast. Ought to be enough for today, I suppose. That's all breakfast right there. Let's head inside, Rosmarine. What? <laughs> it's nothing. Lock looks like you're gonna be eating good tonight. <laughs> oh no. At least wait. What does she do? The same way if my parents made something I don't necessarily like, but I'd be like, delicious. Hey Summer, I got some food for you. Hopefully my parents are watching. It's tastier than it looks, isn't it? <laughs> Could have been worse, that's for certain. Anything Could tastes good when you're hungry, I, I find. That is true. Food tastes the best when you're hungry. You know, like I would, like I've eaten things before. That I was like, mm, I would rather eat something else. But if I'm hungry, oh, I'm about to tear it up. Uh, I suppose today went well, all things considered. I must keep an eye on her, lest these folks... Sorry. Say, Elise, I've been meaning to ask you something. Hmm? 
Those shoes you found this morning. Now that you mention it. What about them? You still haven't told me much about them. I've seen them before in my dreams as long a long time ago. In your dreams? I'm sorry, I Elise, is there something you're not telling me? I don't know where to start, Rosemarine. I've been avoiding thinking about it, but this morning in Kieferberg, I... It's fate, Elise. Our fates, Elise. They're finally starting to align. Huh? What are you talking about? <laughs> oh, never mind. Rosemarine. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. I forgot about that part. Last stream, there was an old lady who was, um... Yeah, it was an old, old lady who was in the dark. You remember that? You've seen, you've seen, you've seen Snow White. The old lady that gave her the mm -hmm. apple. That's what she looked like. Why would he eat that? Well, why would, are they, you know why would he eat it? No, I'm talking, we didn't eat the apple. You, I don't know I know, why. I know you didn't eat that. I'm saying, why would you take the... I didn't take anything from her. I'm just saying that's how she looked. She is. Oh my she god, exactly. You're exaggerating. Oh my god. She's gonna die. She's gonna eat the shoe that she's gonna die. What? <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't. I'm gonna just walk away from this one. You're talking about eating <laughs> shoes and everything. I saw an old hag, Jesus. Rosemary. She told me about this Patreon, uh, this Patreon saint in the woods. That he grants folks wishes if they bring him gifts. So it's true after all. Oh, wait. What is she talking did she, about? Did she wish for shoes? Uh. Is that what she wished for wish on? No, he has a granny anyone with his to, to bring him the gifts to get their wish. You've heard all about this okay, before? Like... Okay. Wait, wait, what it was? Uh -huh. No, I'm just questioning what were the options. Because if one of them was like, oh, you know, tons of food, I'll take it over. Expert, was, if there was tons of food, I would pick tons of food because I'm tired of working. <sighs> Bread is too expensive. Maybe I can myself like a pretzel that's not half eaten. Uh, you've heard all about this before? <laughs> carry on, carry on. She said I must bring him three gifts. The tender flesh, sweetest <gasps> nectar, good company. What? Don't read into too much of it, don't worry. Flesh? Don't worry. Oh, Elise, that's wonderful. Mmm, Rosmarina. This man doesn't sound like good news. I mean, you're, you're the one that talks first, I can't really. What else did she say? Did she mention your fate? Rosemary, you're scaring me with all this nonsense. <laughs> well, there's nothing to be afraid of, Elise. You know, I... How do you know about all this? It's an old folks tale my granny used to tell me. Uh... A folks tale? Uh -huh. Carry on now. What else did she say? Mm. She I don't, mentioned. I don't like that. She's up. Yeah. She mentioned finding a dwelling in the woods. That he will grant my wish if I bring him the three gifts. Made from these testaments. You told her your wish, didn't you? I did, but it's nothing of, out of the ordinary. It's. Don't tell me. Oh. Very forceful. Oh, well, yeah, if you tell somebody your wish, then you don't, you don't get it. Yeah. It's like on your birthday. It's like a birthday rule. Yeah. Uh, I'm sorry. You can't tell other folks about your wish, Elise. Exactly. Rosemary, you have to tell me what's going on. Oh, all I know yes. is that, all I know is what my granny told me, but I could tell you all about it, Elise. I can help you. I don't know if I want, want to do this, really. Rosemarine. <laughs> I need to think about this. I'll be here tidying up. You can ask me anything you'd like. Alright. I don't. I don't know. Talk to Rosamine about the gifts. Okay. Rosamine. You don't have to look so frightened, Elise. This is all very overwhelming, is all. Oh, Elise, it's 
isn't isn't fate such a wonderful thing? Enough about enough of that, Rosemary. What are these three? What are these testaments and gifts? Oh, of course. In order to meet him, you're going to have to gather the testaments to resolve to your resolve. Oh. These are the tool. These are tools and ingredients you will have to use when crafting the gifts. It's common courtesy to bring your whole your house wait your host nice gifts when visiting, isn't it? Um, not wrong actually. But that's usually when you're like going to a party, in my opinion. Yeah, no, I don't. I don't bring my friends. Like, that's good stuff. When I just go hang out. Other than myself, and maybe it's Yeah, good. myself is the good testament. Yeah. Got my dog in here too now, yay. That was a wonderful, wonderful thing. Wonderful. <laughs> yeah, but I don't bring anything besides myself. That, that's all they're getting. And the good spirits and the good vibes. Huh? Ah, there's also the trials. But I can tell oh. but I can tell you all about his folktale later. Alright then. For now I want to know. Uh, the tender flesh. I'm assuming good company is like the person you're most friend, most have the most hearts with. The sweetest nectar. What is a tender flesh? I don't quite like the sound of it, but oh, you're the one making it sound bad at least. The tender flesh represents your body, the vessel of your soul, to speak, so to speak. A representation of your own flesh, then. Does that mean you're representing yourself? We're giving him ourself. Mm. Yeah, no, that needs to be specified. All that matters is that you carry parts mm. of your mortal body. Uh. Huh? It's nothing to be afraid of, Elise. It can be a. Was it a nail clipping or a strand of hair? Okay. What's Maybe important is. <laughs> What's important is the connection between you and the symbol symbolic vessel. The symbolic vessel? Rosemary. Uh, what's the sweetest nectar? It's not as though I don't have any idea, but I don't quite like it. It represents your vitality, vitality, at least your essence. Hmm. Huh? Hmm. Not necessarily. Mm, okay. You you don't mean. All that matters is that it carries a part of your mortal body. Hmm. A lot of this is sounding very suspicious. Have you ever heard of song "Don't Be Suspicious," Mary? <laughs> You're being very suspicious right now. A part of my mortal body, huh? I know what you're thinking, at least. That could it be if that's what you're uh, you're inclined to bring him, but what is it, Rosemary? These are meant to be as proof of your resolve first and foremost. It's your de deter determination determinate no oh god. It's your determination that's the most important at least. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> what is the good company? I don't know what to think of this one. You should meet him when your soul is at its most vulnerable. Oh, that is, that's just... Mm. I don't think you want to meet someone when you're at your most vulnerable at all, usually. Unless there's someone that's very close to you, I would assume. At its most vulnerable? Granny used to say, good company brings one's most inner self to light. One's true face, in other words. Rosemary, I'm not sure I understand. Why, it's love, Elise. Love? 
Love reveals all, wouldn't you say? I suppose. I need time to think. I still can't wrap my head around this nonsense, Rosemary. That's alright, Elise. I'll be here if you have any more questions. I think I need a moment. Bring him, bring him gifts made of testaments. I'm supposed to find these somewhere, but where? Mm. Okay, I think I'm supposed to go to bed now. I think I'm good. I could go outside to see if there's anything there. I don't think there's anything outside, if I'm being quite honest. So it's very dark here. Oh, there is stuff outside. Ha ha ha, I knew it. Oh, it's Golden Girl. Just another girl with a wish. Supposedly, okay, so Golden Girl is supposed to be like the um, same as us in a sense. She uh, did everything he asked and she got her wish granted. But of course, you know, as we can see, her wish was granted, but not the way she wanted. So basically, it's like the genies be careful what you wish for stuff. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm assuming. Probably. Just another girl with a wish. Doesn't anyone, doesn't everyone have a wish or two? Not all that meet him do. I was once what you would call the good company, despite those red shoes. Wait, so... Is this a different girl? Is this a different one or the same one? Cause she's she said she was the good company. So she was brought by someone else. Oh. The objective of her affection, I suppose. What are you talking about? I was forsaken in his den by the one I loved. Whoever you bring keep to keep him company. Bear in mind, this will be their fate. Rosemary. The good company? Rosemary. Oh You're no. Oh no. <laughs> Basically, who do I want to sacrifice is what he's really saying. Mingles. <laughs> it would be good if we could sacrifice I mean, have an option for no, that's not a bad option. True. Okay, I just want to make sure there's nothing inside here, because clearly there was like a whole thing out there. Okay. It would seem that, from what I can see, there's possibilities you can definitely, um... Well, maybe you don't, because... Like, I've been seeing the Golden Girl a lot. It's a possibility that maybe you can actually skip past her, because clearly she's warning you about what's going to possibly happen. Uh-huh. So it's like a possibility that if I didn't go see Leb at this time, I wouldn't meet the Golden Girl. She wouldn't have told me bad things about him and his witches and his wishes. Or if I went outside, I could have went to bed. Because he didn't tell me to go outside. There's a possibility that she might not have been there this morning and I wouldn't have met her, basically. Yeah. I saw this fireflies. I don't know how I'm getting these. I have three fireflies. Where, did, where am I getting these fireflies from? I don't entirely know. Gifts, huh? I best go to bed. I'll make sure. I'll make sense all of it tomorrow. Oh no! It's the witching hour. Huh. The witching hour, spooky. For goodness sake! I can't sleep. I can't stop thinking about all this nonsense. <sighs> Everything that old hag told me about the testaments, the gifts, about him. But Rosemary told me too. I find it hard to believe, but maybe, maybe it's true. If I do gather the, these testaments, if I find my 
way to him. Maybe I can finally leave this wretched town and live the life I'm meant to live. Start anew someplace far, far away. Wait, what? Heck, this is the way. <laughs> she doesn't want this life, though. Get what get what you ask for. Got that right. This could very well be my chance for happiness. No. No. <laughs> no, just no. Let's go! I'll at least try. I have to go to the woodland and find out right right now. Oh. Why in the middle of the mm. There's no need for that nonsense. Then another one bites the dust. Do, do, Where's do, the woodland? Do, do. And another one bites the dust. Ah, uh, what's down there? Ow. Oh, uh, look at the moon. It reminds me of Soul Eater. Yeah. Ah, uh, the blood moon. We'd love to see it. <laughs> oh. I'd like to do something with all this junk, I suppose. Yeah. Let's go ahead and uh, save just in case. Uh, I have a feeling things are mm, not going to be the best. I can see that idea. Mm, just, just an idea. It's just a little something. Tells me that this isn't like a, you know, the best time to do this stuff. Personally, I would never be like, I just can't sleep. Let me go out to the woods. <laughs> yeah. That is a little bit strange. Mm, got that right. Is this the way? I need to go over here, okay. Go past the river. And then go downwards. To the woodland. Ah, I'm stuck! Not very nice place. It's all spooky. It's scary, and it's a skeleton. Okay. Let's see if that's if what the old hag said is true. Keep it together, at least. Have to at least try. Okay. Oh no. Can I leave? I don't want to be here. I don't like this. Bye, Cassidy. Jesus. So this is the woodland? The trees have faces, and the butterflies have eyes on the back of their, their wings. This is not the yeah, place to be. Didn't the butterflies say hello? Mm -hmm. Can they turn away from me? No. I have to find like him. You. I had to be brave. Mm. Braver than me. Oh, <laughs> brave? No. I was very close. Oh no. Oh no no no. I don't like this. Oh what happened there? Um, I think someone's getting eaten. What is this? What is this wretched place? And you walk right into it, it was like you want to go in here. I don't know why you're surprised. This is what you wanted. <laughs> I best be careful. This could be dangerous. No. Could never. Find the secret in the woods. There's hands on the ground. What is this? How do I draw these moths here? All I, all I have got on my, on me is my lantern. Oh, could I like? Oh no! Oh no! The hand tried to get me. Oh, oh no! Oh! Get over there! Smacked me. Oh, this a helping hand. 
macking me. This is this got their attention, I suppose. I better be careful moving forward. Okay, this freaking hand smacking me. What happened? Oh, it's another golden girl. What in the? So they're all different ones, I think. Yeah. Have you met the witch? She's so very eager to meet you again. Would you believe? The witch, you say? Your paths are bound to cross before long, but I have my doubts you'll last long in that in the black wilderness. Wait. When the Lord's name Oh my god, my sanity just keeps on dropping. Okay, let's get out of here. Ooh, thanks. Oh, they gave me five matches, thank god. I didn't think I was gonna have enough. Oh, I could jump off. These, these, everything has eyes. The flowers, the butterflies, the freaking trees. This is just a weird place. I don't like eyes. How do I? What am I, huh? Hold the phone. What am I? What am I? Oh. I'm so. Wait. Oh, wait, 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 Ah. I'm a smart cookie. I promise. I can solve puzzles. <laughs> Sometimes. I'm gonna have to go over here. Then I need to go to this one really quickly. Then I got a, got a mushroom. Is that supposed to do something for me? Yeah, mushrooms make people feel special. Oh, they give me one health. Okay. Yeah, special. Uh huh. I need to go... No, this is good right here. I need to go up here. Then I need to go over here. I need to go up here. God. That is such a freaking maze. Okay. I'm gonna try to mess this up because I don't want to do this again. You're gonna do it again? I'm so excited. Okay, what is this? Another golden girl? Yep. Take my head. My t oh, head. Take heed. She's taking advantage of you. Who is? That creature. She goes hungry. It's you she wants. Your flesh. The witch? Don't allow her to interfere with your wish. How would she interfere exactly? Wait. Her interest, her interference, she says. A fancy, oh, kinkershif, kinkershif. Okay, my sanity is getting lower and lower by like the moment each time. I should probably use that oil. Did I eat it? Did I did I count as me? Yeah, yeah, it should it should at least. I mean, it doesn't go up by much because it's only ten. Oh, I still need to go up here. Okay, I'm gonna do this all again. Okay. Go up here. Go up here. Okay, here we go. We can save. Oh, no. What in the Lord's name? There's so many. I must find a way to distract them. Let me save first. Hold up. This is a very bad place to be. Oh, no. I've fallen and I can't get up. 
Yes. Okay. I will say, I did think it is funny that what's it called? The one time when you're like, oh, well, I guess I'm gonna go ahead and, uh, I guess I'm gonna go ahead and go right after this night, and then it drags into this. Yeah. Well, I basically said I wanted to, like, get past this day. Yeah, and it's still this day. Yeah. I got more mushrooms. What's down? Yeah. Okay, so down here is simply light. Simply lighting, it may be enough. It may not be enough. So okay, I need to bring them over. I gotta be ready to run. Ah! Ah! Okay, there we go. Okay, so where there must be some other ones around here. Uh, this one I can break this thing. Oh, they give me so many mashes. How many? If you just want to hand them out like hotcakes, then I'll take them personally. Uh, it must be down here. I'm assuming. Like, they give me so many. Come on, run, 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 at least run! Okay, what is that, though? It's open. Oh my god. I love the music and all, it does definitely add so much. What is this? It looks like dog dough remains. I've never seen such a thing before. The crystalline skeleton remains reminds remains of a dough. Every bone barren of any kind of life. They ate they, they ate the deer clean. Oh no. Oh, they give me so many mashes. Oh, okay, I, apparently I need to save every time because it might set me back. I'm just gonna put it right here. No, sorry. Oh, oh no. I need to find where at least where the thing is. What is this? More matches? Jesus. There isn't much, there isn't much light here, so maybe if I draw them to this carcass. Okay. These are drawn to flesh, it seems. I have to lure them out of the way, but they'll keep following me if I don't turn my lantern off. Okay, so I gotta be ready to basically turn it off. Oh. Oh no. Ah! Oh my god! Jesus! Oh my goodness! I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. Oh my god. Death by butterfly. I see why there was a save point right there. That you should run fast. Drawn the flesh, but it seems I don't. They'll keep following me if I don't turn my lantern off. Okay, so I kind of be. Wait, so you left it off? Okay. You just gotta run past, and then just. Okay, yeah, let me go ahead and just uh, go on the hill a little bit. <laughs> Things are getting a little bit crazy. Oh, it's another golden girl. Okay, I gotta stop. I don't know if I want to talk to these golden girls. They're running my sanity to the ground. <laughs> what? 
makes you think that? They're all very different girls, it seems. They're all red shoes, too. Some of them have red shoes. We golden maidens are to be sneered at. You'll understand in time, I'm certain. Why would you say that? My, you can't possibly think he'll give you his blessing. I was told otherwise. Oh, such a na naivety. How amusing of you. How, what? How amusing you are. I can't wait to welcome you. What are you infiltrating? What an infuriating character. Oh, a leather purse. Oh my god, my sanity is getting low. Oh wait, <laughs> now I gotta lure them back. <laughs> Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. See why they give us so many matches now. So do you just think that they were being generous? No, no, no. Yep. No, no. No, no, no. no. Okay, I finally got the hang of it now. Gotta be quick with it, though. It's on the flick of the wrist. Can I get some, like, oil or something? Because I really do need some sanity. It's getting really low. Am I spotting these scribbles scattered about? Are these people? Engraved into the, the rocky surface are similar, several familiar shapes reminiscent of human life. It wasn't a witch, it was a wizard. It was a wizard. Yep, cause that's a male witch. I think so. Yep. <gasps> Grape juice, thank you. You're so kind. I've been needing it. Okay, so where am I taking these guys? Oh, I'm taking them back here. Okay. Okay. Are these different remains or the same ones? Is so much light? No, there's just the yeah. That's insane that you're already saying that's a casual. Oh. Ow! Mother! They aren't devouring that thing, huh? Maybe they'll clear the path if I lure them all here, but they'll keep following me if I don't turn off my lantern. Oh, what is this? Very to the deep rocky surface are similar shapes. Oh, yes, same thing basically. Do you want to come? They aren't following me. Did I turn my freaking lantern off? No. They don't let these keep hitting me! Why don't you let it off and then like, try to uh, investigate? Because it says something about the lantern. And it goes on. And let me, let me see. They're, dev they're devouring that thing, huh? Maybe they'll clear the path for me if I lure them all here, but... They'll keep falling. Yeah, yeah, I understand. They're not coming! Huh. They said if they devour it all, if I keep luring them over here. Oh, so I need... To oh... Freaking things. I'm bringing you over there! Put it off, put it off, put it off! Okay. Okay. 
it's gotta be. It's gotta leave them over there. Okay, now, <laughs> now, I, now, now I understand. You, you ran over there, and then you kind of you ran in circles. I'm like, no. Okay, I, I understand. I understand. I understand. I understand. You understand? You understand the the, the corner now? Woo! No, no, no. Okay. Let's a lot of those mushrooms can for nothing. Bring enough of them just so they can eat the body. Yeah. Then... Woo, woo, woo. Hey! Stop it! Numb, numb, numb. Oh my god. Oh my god, these monsters. It wasn't that bad. Terrible. Attacking it wasn't me. That bad. Oh no. Oh! You could have left a couple more. X bar? Yes. Uh, do you see what I see? Uh, I see butterflies. Do you see the one look a little higher? Uh. That's oh, like a little egg. Is that an egg thing? In the center, it's like a little egg. Well, I can't see it that well. It looks like an egg. It's a little round. Got a little bow in it. Uh, uh huh. We see things very differently. What? Look, I don't. Am I supposed to be something, something different? Um. Looks like a head. Someone's a particular head. Uh. Yeah, You've come to me at last. Don't be frightened, Elise. Come closer. Mm. No. Don't you dare come closer. Crazy. Oh, no. What is this? What in the Lord's name? Now tell me you see this and then you think. Yeah, I still want to get this guy to grant my wish. You've done I don't want to wish <laughs> You've done well to find your way in these woods. It's imperative, Elise, that you listen to me closely. Oh, it's her head in the basket. Oh. But those aren't her eyes. No, they are, but they look very different when they're not. Lies. Sparkling with greed. Yeah, when she's not greedy and she's dead, she looks very different. <laughs> Uh, here's once more trying to make your way from me, but not for long. Oh, he's once trying to take you away from me, huh? This basket. Oh, excuse me. Hello, Bert. Take, the ba take this basket now. You ought to gather the gifts in it, uh, Elise. The gifts, you say? Find your way to him deeper in the gro in this grove of mine. Only then may your wish come to fruition, my beloved. What is this? What are you? I will guide you to him, Elise. You ought to trust my word. Mm, you're my head in a basket. I don't... Yeah. No. Your precious wish will, will be safe with me. How am I to find him? You, Elise, are my kin, my tramp, my trumpet, my beloved prodigy. Mm. What he's done to me is no matter. All I want is you. Mm. The straw basket. Hey, she asked me that I liked her. I would say we're this Oh, now it's the witch. There she is, Akbar, look. I will allow much. him and his pets into my woodland once more. I will allow him to tempt you, to toy with you. Um, what are you? All for the greater good, my beloved, so that we can re be reunited, so that I can bear life in my womb once more. Huh? I'm losing my wits! 
I need to get out of here. PG thirteen, real quick. Finally, she's making some sense. So can I? So I can retrieve what's mine. She's gone insane. She's insane. She's insane. She's insane. Oh my god! The she's fudge. She's flower queen. She's oh. The, she's, yeah, she's the butterfly queen. I need to go this way. Oh, this is so nice. What fudge am I going? Look, guys, that's the flower queen. Oh, this is the butterfly queen. Oh my god. So good at that. Oh. I'm about to die. So good I'm about to die. I'm about to die. Um, get good. There I go. I don't, I don't, I don't know. <laughs> okay, this time I didn't know there were hands on the ground. Okay. This game is dangerous. Can imagine you can only do it one time. Oh. Oh. I have to go I'm through all this. Up. How do I skip again? No, it's the up one. The up, the up key. The up key, huh? The up arrow key. That's, that's what it shows for the skip it's, area. It doesn't, it it's not actually that, though. Uh, I gotta figure what else it is. I guess we're screwed. Oh god, I. I mm. <laughs> what is this? Can we go to alt? No, oh, I have to keep oh, it. Doesn't show as an option right now. Yeah, I'm gonna have to skip it all now. I just press. No, I'm gonna constantly keep clicking. Oh, this is. Thank you. I don't want to do this again. Can I leave? Okay, old lady, leave. Is it Q? E? R? T? T? No. Y? H? M? B? I'm gonna say the whole alphabet at this point. Tap? Caps? <laughs> shift? It's shift. There it is. Ah, I went the wrong way again like an idiot. Okay, so you should go the right way. Trying. No, no, not getting me again. Stupid hand. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Not getting me again. You're stupid. Oh, shoot! I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Run, you idiot! I Move! Get hit one more time, otherwise it's probably dead. Oh, well, now you really can't get hit. Oh my god, I left there on Death Store. Jesus. Oh my god. What in the Lord's name? What's that thing? Really, you shouldn't have gone in the woods in the first place, but we won't talk about that. Keep it together, Elise. I need to get a grip. I need to get a grip and go home to Rosemary. Really? Gifts menu unlocked. I don't want the gifts menu. I'm on Death's door. Use the basket menu to check on your progress. Gathering the tender flesh, sweetest nectar, and good company. Okay. Find your way home. Let me, uh... Oh my gosh, she looks beat up on here. There she is. I have bandages, don't I? I have ointment. There we go. I'm gonna apply this. I don't want to use everything, but at this point, I want to be in good health at least. That should be good. Oh, I have well... Oh, it's in this menu. Let me use this. Oh, thank God. What does this uh, fancy thing do? A pretty kinkerchief. Detailedly embroidered and, hand and hammered with delicate lace. Oh, a handkerchief. Handkerchief, okay. It may sell for a reasonable price. Oh, so these are all things I can sell. <gasps> I can sell these things? Oh my god. I can actually get money. Let's get out of here. Oh no. It's flock. Flock. 
lock? What are you doing here? Oh no, Flock. What's wrong with you? Why do I look like that? I thought you'd be in... I didn't know his eyes was... Yep. I thought you'd be in the granary or out and about. Goodness, I don't feel so good. Flock, you're starting to scare me. You were cute. What is it, Flock? I don't like the way he's staring at me. Flocks, honey, we... Don't do this to me. You're so cute. He starts no, talking. No. What are you? Please. No. Please. That's... Rosemary. Oh. oh. Okay, Flock. Rosemary, you're starting to scare me. I don't want either of you anymore. What are you doing here? Oh. Oh no. He was walking close to me and Sandersonly, now he sees Ro Rosemary right there. He's jumping around like nothing happened. Oh, that's psychotic right there. Look. It's like, like some kind of child is about to kill you because you're the babysitter. I want to murder someone for a very long time. She's their mom. Hey, mom. She was just teaching me how to draw a picture. Like, oh no. I was, I was out on a walk. Flock, I don't, I don't like this anymore. This late at night. There's Flock again, acting cute when he wanted to actually murder us. What is it, Flock? Come, let's go home, Rosemary. I don't want to stay here a minute longer. Oh, but I. Elise, wait. Everything has just got wrong. <sighs> it's morning already. <laughs> I suppose I really did go to the woods, didn't I? The woodland. Mm. I don't know what to think of it all, but both Rosemary and the old hag, neither are lying, it seems. Are you just supposed to believe them? Anyone can tell you, tell you a believable truth. Or, I'm sorry, a believable lie. <laughs> I have to pull myself together. It's best I head out to work for now. I'll lose my wits if I keep. Oh no, the ghost. Oh no, he's back. Rosemary and Flock? What are they doing out there? I don't want to. I don't want to look personally. Flock <laughs> scares me. I have six. Uh, what is it? Fireflies. Okay. But the bigger that's out. Oh no. <laughs> Two are always making making merry, huh? Good morning, Elise. Ah, uh, good morning, Elise. Oh, she already said it for me. There's Flux jumping around. And I'll never be able to look at him the same. Good morning to you, too, Flock. It's a goat. <laughs> that goat looking, he was about to stand on his hind legs and butt punch me in the face. I like the way he was looking at me. I picked some mushrooms this morning, Elise. We could have them for breakfast. Say, Rosemary. You put Flock away in the granary last night, right? Of course. I think he's taking a liking to you, too. Oh, no. I always leave the door a little ajar just in case. I see. Is that so? Elise. Is everything alright, Elise? You seem to be on edge last night, too. It's nothing, Rosemary. I had a strange dream, is all. I know you went and went to the woods, Elise. I'm sorry, I... 
You don't have to tell me about it, but... You know what... You, what is it? You know now, don't you? That I'm speaking the truth? Dude. Block. Not now. <laughs> Block is eternal. Oh, God. Anyhow, come along. Let's head to work. You're talking to me to... You're taking me to the town? Let's stick... let stick to our story, don't we? Come now, let's head to town. Elise. Ah, wait for me, Elise. I don't know, not for lock two. I don't know. You stay there. Okay, he's in the party. But that is where we'll be ending this episode. Episode. I gotta stop saying it. I'm still not used to streaming. Ending this stream off because it's been how long has it been actually? Three hours. <laughs> yeah, basically three hours. My god. I intend to go for this lock, but yeah, we got a lot of work done today. I almost I got murdered a lot. Um yeah, it was <laughs> it was fun being murdered and stuff. But that is where we be ending this stream. So, hopefully you had a wonderful time because I had time, thing, and place doing this. Hope you had a wonderful time, everybody, and goodbye, everybody. Goodbye, everybody.